have to understand how things are up here. Things are up here. Dude. I don't um, know what you're talking about, sir. But sir, I'm telling you right now, sir. If you all took something off my motor, sir, other than putting sir, the oil, taking the oil shut out, up. Okay, shut up, hey, shut up. Do not tell shut me, up. Mr. Do not tell me to shut up. Shut up. I have just about had enough of your shit, man. I so will come over the there and slap and the shit. Leave sh me hey, alone. You, no, you understand this, Mister? I didn't call you and tell you. That I left the 10 millimeter socket in your motor. You called me. So don't tell me to shut up. Don't tell me all this bullshit. And if you have to give you loop in Jeff City, I will come there right now and whip your fucking ass. Do you oh, understand I what I'm telling you? I'll slap the taste out of your mouth, boy. Do you understand me? Listen, boy, you don't talk to Do me not like that. Call me back, you stupid son of a bitch. I'm going to call a lot. I am done. We with are going to resolve this, Doug. I will resolve your fucking head. Damn, here we go. What are you talking about? We're on the air? This is Ron? Absolutely. Get ready for the funniest damn prank call show there is. That's right, bitches. It's the Macron Show at macronshow.com. And if you don't like this, go and f*** yourself. Excuse me, sir. Can you tell me who you are? Say, call me. Oh, give me a break. What are you calling about? Who are you anyway? What the hell is this? Who is this? Aren't you having fun? And now, your host, Macron. Macron. Ah, hello. Yeah. Welcome, 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 welcome. It's Mondays with Macron again. Yay. It's already March. I always get really confused with the date around this time of year because of the whole, the way they do it differently in America and Canada. So like it would be 030424 right now today, but in Britain it's 040324. So it gets really confusing. I don't know if it's the 3rd of April or the 4th of March today, but uh, actually it's it's the 4th of March, which is actually the 17th of March on the metric calendar. Don't get those two confused. Belfast sending me sound bites to play the fat people. What is this? Look at me, I'm a big fat slob. <laughs> okay, fine. We'll do some We'll do some fat bastard on them. How are you all doing out there? Have you had a great week? I hope you have. I've had a lot of fun this week. Done a lot of good supporter shows this week. Had a lot of cool shit going on. Make sure you're a supporter for God's sake. I assume everyone that gets here on time on a Monday is already a supporter. Because, like, why Why wouldn't you be? Why wouldn't you be? But if not, it's macronshow.com forward slash join. And it's full of good stuff. Joe, who already did a tip... I saw Joho. I saw Joho was in the chat like 15 minutes before the show started. Joho was in the chat like, hurry up, hurry up. I love that. I love that. Thank you so much, Joho. And then during the intro, before I even got a chance to plug it, he's, he was like leaving, leaving tips. He said, thank God it's Monday. I love that. Thank you, Joho. Please go to macronshow.com forward slash tip and support the show. I need all the money I can get. Especially if I want to keep traveling around the world visiting all you guys, which I'm gonna gonna keep doing Yeah, I have to fly I have to fly back to England tomorrow. That sucks, but only temporarily very temporarily <laughs> I Suppose it's nice to show your face in your own house once every six months <laughs> Like hello, I'm home. Goodbye but yay, thanks for being here, everyone. Let's see if we've got in Discord this week. Shut up! 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 It's showtime. Shut up. Who's playing me? Who's that listening to me? Shut up! Get wow. get it together, look, you Look at the fucking attitude, guys. Bastards. I, I say yeah. we fucking tell him to fuck off. Don't you, know? you fucking start <laughs> shit with me. Right. Hello. There's a, there, hey, Ron, there's a rumor going around I need to ask you about. Ah, oh, fucking here we go. Right, tonight in the studio we have Dale down south, Belfast, Hazel, I got Munson, and Ronnie, uh, Ray and Karma, the golden couple. Dr. Charles isn't here right now. I know he just had surgery on his wrist today because he was wanking too much and it broke. Well, well, that's not the what rumor. we heard. That's not what we heard. <laughs> Tell him the rumor. Go on. Here we okay. fucking go. Here we, we go. Heard, go. We heard, Here's the big joke. We heard the Come only on, guys. reason the, the only reason you're going back to Europe is uh 
to go help Dr. Charles jerk off because he can't jerk off no more. It is true, but I'm only doing it for the money. It's nothing sexual at said, my end. We said, instead of you going said dog sit, instead, no, of, instead, no. of dog, instead of going dog sit, you're going cock sit. Cock sit. <laughs> 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 oh, oh, I'm going cock sitting, am I? Okay, all right. Let's get started, shall we? <laughs> Holy Why? Fuck. Why should we even do that? <laughs> no, I mean, let's get fucking started. We're just roasting each other tonight. It's... It's not going to get any better than that, so maybe we end it here. Yeah, all right. <laughs> yeah, right. They were the golden shower couple. Look, Ew. Dr. Charles oh, has God. been a very good friend since I was like six years old. Someone's got to do it. Okay, that's all I'm saying. The poor guy hasn't jerked off in like two weeks. He's becoming a real nuisance to everyone I mean, around him. He uses his other hand. It's like, it's like doing it to a stranger. It never works as well. You guys know this. Come on now. I know, but it's, it's like a stranger. We were watching... Um, Hazel and I were watching the Sexy Beast TV series last night, which is based on that movie we had for movie night um, a few months ago. And uh, there's a scene in there where they catch this woman stealing. So they put her hands on the desk and they get a hammer. And she's like, she's like, what hand do you touch yourself with? And she's like, not telling them. She's like, tell me which hand you diddle yourself with or I'm going to break both of them. <laughs> and then she ends up breaking both of them. It's a very good show, though. It's a very fucking good show. You should, uh, you should all go watch that. And he did the front bottom line again. That was fucking epic. You know the whole when he's on front the plane and he, and he does the front bottom line, except he changes it to front back this time. So now we've <laughs> got to start saying front back. No, back bottom. Back bottom. We're saying front back. Back bottom. That's what he says. He's like, he touched my back right. bottom. He touched my back bottom. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good show. It's a really good show. Don't listen to the reviews. It's fucking amazing. It's really good. It's like, um, it's very similar to, in style to like Lock, Stock and Two Smoking Barrels and Snatch, like the way they've done it. Like that really fucking quick fire fucking, but it's good. Really, really good. Go watch it. All right, let's get the voicemails out of the way. 11 minutes into the show, people start bitching if they don't hear a call really fucking quickly. Fuck the people, man. Uh, they've, well, you know, I am trying to fuck the people. That's why I have all those apps. But look, listen, we have to get the voicemails out of the way. Everybody listened to, listened last week when I complained that there weren't enough voicemails because we have a whole bunch of them this week. So thanks for right, listening, you guys. Half of them are dumb. If you're listening back to this on the podcast and you can't see the number scrolling by on the screen on YouTube, if you do ever want to leave a voicemail, the number is 877-515-6969. That number again, 877-515-6969. Call now. Let's make, let's make something different. Let's open a line for the listeners to call in today. Yeah. Guess want to do maybe, that? I can do maybe that. They wanna, I can maybe do that they immediately. Wanna comment, maybe they want to comment on those buttons on your shirt. Maybe they have something oh, to say about that gayness. Here we go. I no. knew it was fucking. I wasn't gonna say. I wasn't gonna say nothing about the little gold button. But I, Come on, I was waiting for this fucking shit to start. Let's fucking pick on James Knight. First of all, I'm wanking off I'm... Dr. Charles. Wait, 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 wait. I'm glad you came. You showed us that you were present today for work. I thought you might have been playing in the basement again. <laughs> Before you left. Yeah, yeah. No, I get it. Good one. All right. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> I, I heard there's a big D and D D and D tournament going on right now. Fucking D and D you in a minute. Yes, I'm wearing my official Toronto Ghostbusters pin badges here. These are official. Official, okay. These are no joke. What's you show the them some. What what's, what it says in the back of the shirt? Basement boys. Basement boys. Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. You show these you badges. You a death row a death row shirt with gold mother. <laughs> I am. I am. That's what I said I to am. him. <laughs> and you're gonna have to deal with it. You're gonna have to deal with it. That's just how I roll. Okay. Wait till Shug Knight sees that shit. He's coming for you exactly. for real. Exactly. <laughs> He's coming for you. Shug Knight can eat my ass. Okay. Shug Knight is. Uh, a... Yeah. He would probably like that. He's been in jail for a long time. <laughs> <laughs> he probably would. That fat bitch. He looks like he eats everything he can get his hands on. Oh. Eat that till you put Big Willie to you. Just imagine, imagine me. I'm an actual YouTuber and I'm here fucking dissing Shug Knight. What if he comes after me? What if he comes for me? What if he What's sends he the do? send the He's bloods? Fucking suck your dick. That's true. Yeah. Hey, if he comes after you, who are you gonna call? <laughs> Snoop Dogg. 
That wasn't. The, the jokes are getting worse now. I thought you guys would have better material. I'm bitterly disappointed, to be honest. I could roast myself I, better than this. I wasn't looking at nothing. Taser brought the Ghostbuster thing. Well, because you were going to open the phone lines. I thought that would be a good place to start. I mean, you really want me to open the phone lines? Yes. Yeah. You, got a, you got extra number? Or <coughs> I, got, I got shitload of I got plenty numbers. of numbers. Don't worry. I can, I can make a number right now. I'll make one just for the show, and then I'll delete it afterwards. Yeah. Give uh, me a somebody, second. Some, uh, All right. Somebody's saying the tip, the tip page goes blank when they try to... Well, Joho yeah. left a tip 11 minutes ago. The tip page goes blank. Uh, let me check that. Show.com forward slash tip. If I go to it and it works, that means you're all wrong. Well, I'm saying nope, it's working people fine. People in chat People in chat complaining. Can you try a different web browser for me? Shit. Okay. Your complaint is not... If you want to leave a tip and uh, a tip page doesn't work, just make a payment at macronpaypal at gmail.com and I'll give you a shout out. That's the, yeah, that's wanna, the way around it. Leave a, if you want to leave a tip for me, it's a ds at slash tip. At slash tip. Slash dot com. There you go. There you go, everyone. Yeah, if you do really... The page is working at my me. end. Yeah, it's working here, Maybe. so I don't know what we can do to fix Maybe it. Maybe clear, clear your um, shit before you go to... Clear your cache, try another web browser, try on your phone, or if, if you are on your phone, then try on a computer or a tablet. But if you're really stuck and you really love me and you want to shout out anyway, just make a payment. Just go to macronpaypal at gmail.com. So go to PayPal, send the money to macronpaypal at gmail.com, and it'll pop up on my phone and tell me, and then I'll give you a shout out anyway. The there we go. The best thing you can do is link Ron's PayPal account to your de direct deposit. Yeah. If anybody could donate like 100k tonight, I mean, that really would... You have no idea how many of my problems that would fix right now. 100k would fix every single problem I have in my entire life, to be honest with you. So come if, on, we gotta hey, have a fucking millionaire listener in here. Come on, I someone... I say I, this every I think, week, like some... I think everybody, everybody listening should give $100 right now. Like, like... I, I know there's people who own private planes and it probably costs more than 100k just to fucking fly to their mom's house for the afternoon, right? So, like, you millionaires, you, you know, 100, anybody, anybody who's like 100k, that's fucking nothing. You know, fucking make it rain, make it happen. Put a link, put a link in the chat, they got, they got some it'll, lazy people. It'll get, me, it'll, it'll get it so that I can live in Canada permanently and it'll uh, mean that I uh, can just sit around doing shows all the time and fucking with people. Make it happen. Come on. Quick 100k. Or like if your parents have got maybe life savings or anything, transfer it to me when they're not looking and then just like hide the card or whatever. And, and No, don't do that. Don't. don't I'll tell you what. Anyone who gives 100k tonight, tonight only, I will give you a free $25 a month God tier <laughs> membership. Tonight only. Fucking do it. Anybody who <laughs> anybody who donates a hundred thousand British schmeckles, or to be honest with you, I'll take a hundred thousand American schmeckles. Either one will do. Uh, within reason, I will fly to your house and dick. personally serenade you with like a prank, a live prank call show, or a song, or I'll do a little dance, whatever you want, or something else. Whatever you want, I'll suck you I off. I don't care. I'll wank you off like I do Dr. <laughs> Charles. I'm very good. I have nice soft hands. Just um, make you it. You do have nice soft hands. I do have nice soft hands, yes, because I don't do a lot of work, you know? Yes, he's always pedic manicuring his nails. And you can see oh, by no. looking. Wow. I'm the poorest oh, person in the world that has rich guy hands. It's true. It's a fact. I should be in the Guinness Book of Records. I have rich guy hands, but I'm the poorest person to do so. And that's that's what happens when you make the Macron show. All right, let's get through the voicemails, because we got a lot. We got a lot of voicemails tonight. And some of them are fucked up. Oh, yeah, shit, you wanted me to get a number. That's what I was doing as well. Open the line, yeah. Uh, let's see. I'll just open up one of my existing lines. Actually, no, I'll make another one, and then it can't be associated with anything I might have done with that number. Uh, let's oh, come see. On, come on. Okay, let's see. Uh, purchase. What do you want the number to be? Do you want an 800 number? I don't give a fuck. Whatever is the first available number, that's what you get. And put it on the screen so the people can call in. Okay, done. <coughs> 
Can you test it for me by calling it, Ronnie? Whoa, this is the number that I got, by the way. <laughs> it's a really good number. Oh, no. It's actually a really fucking good number. I might keep it. How do you pull that off? Yeah, look how, how cool it... Like, that's an easy number to remember. And look at the last two numbers. Four numbers. Four numbers. Uh, yeah, just give it a call for me, off. Ronnie. Make sure it works. I just found it. I just found it. That's pretty easy to get. So what I'll do is I'll, uh, I'll make some text Let's appear on the try. screen. Once we've tested it... Who is this? Who is this? Test, test, test. Ah! Working. Working. All right. Do you guys actually want to call in? <laughs> oh, fuck. I can't. Remember. Whose fucking idea was this? All man, right. Let's fucking do it, man. Let's do it. I can, I can just turn the number off whenever I want. It doesn't exactly matter. If it gets too annoying, too fucked up, but... Bear with me a if second. If people want to talk to us in, in private, in person, actually, not in private, but in person, they got some sensible questions. If they want to tell us how much they love us, they can call us and let us know, you know? Oh, well, I got told, I got told by Bancho that today I'm on a list. Perfect. I wish they'd put they, me on a list. <laughs> said, the dude said, the dude, hello, this is Chris. I said, hello, Chris. He said, oh, shit, you on the list, and he hung up on me. <laughs> so I don't know what list he's talking about. All right, the number to call in is 3347446969. There you go. 3347446969. <laughs> call that number, it'll get you straight through to the studio. Boom, done. I dare you to call in. Let's do the voicemail. People are going to fucking call during the voicemail. Oh, there we go. <laughs> you answer it, Ronnie. You answer it. You made this happen. Let's do it. Hello, hello. Hello? Who's this? This is Matt, uh, Harry front and back, um, good. bottom. <laughs> How you doing, Ronnie? How big is your good? cock? Oh, yeah, that's, that, uh, that's four inches circumcised. Things, four that's inches it? circumcised. Ah, oh, Jesus Christ. Man, tie no, your weight that's no or something on the fucking thing and just spread your legs and walk around. Well, you're, you're much picture. bigger than my husband. Oh! Good oh! oh! Wow! wow. Great. Oh! Wow. Wow. <laughs> what's your response? Ray, what, what do you say we'll fucking that? we'll compare and we'll fucking put pictures in discord yeah if you could all uh text pictures of your dicks to this number two and now uh, we'll compare them well look at how he fills out that tutu look how cute i uh, appreciate y'all so much it's fucking told Ronnie, you not to post that big man. oh thanks thanks for calling in you see barely much left all right bye Aww. <laughs> there we go we got a sensible caller well done Ronnie. good people all right, voice hey, Mac Ron, this fuck pet, better known as convict pet. Anyways, just wanted to drop you a line real quick. Say thank you for the show. I've probably been listening for about a year and a half. I've had a real crappy job. About the fuck, here we go. Sex offenders register. Mac Ron, you think? <laughs> 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 the fuck was that? <laughs> that show is for people over 18. You guys know that, right? <laughs> As if I said sex offenders register when they had sex. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck. If we don't okay. get bent tonight, it's gonna happen. <laughs> There goes my ad revenue again and again. <laughs> We're fucking 20 minutes into the show and it's gone. Okay. Been for about a year and a half, I've had a real crappy job for about the last year and a half. I'm about to get a new one, but um, I just want to thank you and, and all the friends of Macron Show for getting me through that year and a half. And uh, it's been an amazing time, man. Y'all have been with me throughout my entire work. And uh, I appreciate it. So anyways, love y'all. Oh, fuck Pat there. Thanks so much. Appreciate that. I'm so glad you got a bad job. That's fucking awesome. Well done to you. That's the shit. There you go. He's doing it. That guy's, that guy's doing it. Hello, this is not the sex offenders register. Hello? Oh, come on. Don't just fucking call come and on, hang guys. out. Come on, don't be a bitch. If you like, if there's trolls watching, at least like say some shit about me or something. Give me a yeah, good. Talk, talk I want some back and forth. It's all me fucking. Mm. Do you know what I mean? Like, give me, give me something. Fucking, you know, cut me deep with something. Who's this? People asking the telephone numbers too. Fuck. 
That guy just said, oh, fuck on the voicemail. All right, who's this? Hello, Macron Joe. This is Vladimir. I'm sorry I haven't left voicemail for you in four months. I just got out of surgery for getting all of these bitches off my dick. As we what? say here. Fishes. <laughs> Did I say hope this? you guys Fishes are on his well. dick, is that what he said? Ron, Scooby, Trainwreck, Ray... Uh, who else, who else, who else? Adel, what? Carpal, everyone, Everybody. I hope you all are well. Let's get MacronShow.com and YouTube up to 50,000 subscribers and 1 million followers by the end of this year. Do it. Make it get happen. It get, get it done. done. I, want, I want his number. He didn't say my name. Did you not shout you out, Diaz? No, he said train wreck. Oh. Shut the fuck up, mom. <laughs> <laughs> Who is calling from Toronto? Mm. Hello? He's a whole, whole house. I can't help. Hello? Oh. Hey. <laughs> hi. Hey, hi. Hey. I know what she's doing here. <laughs> the, the call is coming from within the house. <laughs> I was like someone from Toronto's calling, and then I was like, oh, that's Hazel's number. He got You're... so happy. He thought, he thought what, it was one of his nerd friends. Oh, yes, they call him. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. They're calling Look, me. They do like me. They do like me. making fun of me. I'm going to fucking hurt you in a minute. Listen. <laughs> oh, well. They do like me. You're, fu you're fucking lucky I didn't read the number out when it came on. <laughs> Corporate office. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, my God. That's like a car full of excited kids. You could tell. <laughs> They're like, let's call, let's call. Let's call. It. And then they didn't know what to say when they, oh, dear. Talk people, motherfuckers. Who's this? I can get my kid to call in, but we'll get banned. What is that? What is well, it? well, well. <laughs> Look at what the cat dug in. <laughs> that old dead carcass. Jeff O'Neill. How did you escape the funeral home? I had you fully involved. Oh, yes. <laughs> but Jeff, it's the Undertaker. I'm gonna need your stiff carcass returned to it's Paul me. Bearer. Paul Bearer. Paul Bearer. Macron, this is Paul Bearer. Yep. And I'm asking you for help to find Jeff and return him into my mortuary. I'm gonna do the hand movement for you. One piece or ten pieces. Macron, this is Paul Bear. I need any help that you can give me more to wear it will be greatly appreciated. Yes. Penis. I, I hate your phone calls and your YouTube channel. Thanks. And stop YouTube when it stop. stop it don't, don't do it for 10 years because you're not going to get 1 million subscribers. Can you go and do your homework now? Can you go get is your parents? A, is, 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 is this a you mini forgot, banjo? It was the, the, mini say, it was the best disc so far, smells. though. It was the best disc so far, though. I like it. Who's that? Like Hello? Smell. Hello? Hello? Hey. Hey. Is this about my body odor? Hello? He hung up. He... Who's my mommy on the phone? <laughs> Why are people scared to talk, man? That little fucking kid's got most balls than anyone. I would. That kid was the only one with the bar. The kid keeps calling now as well. He's like, <clears throat> he's using his real number too, Ronnie. That's the thing. He's probably using his parents' you phone. You fucking kid. Like it's okay. <laughs> Hi. Hello. Hi. What, See, what, what have you done, Ronnie? They're, they're, come on, give me something. Yeah, give me something to work with. Hello? 
<laughs> you got hit by a train. Run, motherfucker, run. <laughs> it's just fucking blowing up now. There's like six calls coming in as we speak. Fuck off, kid. Oh. That's, the, that's the sink. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> If you become hey, too man. annoying. Hello. Oh, there you go. Who's this? Yeah. Hey, here we go. Man, what? Where's oh, my got... money? <laughs> you ain't getting your money, bitch. Right here. It's right my here. money. It. It's my money now. I want that in the shit, and fuck you. Give me my money. <laughs> That's my money. No, it's no my money. money for you. No, no man, money for shit. you. No. I want my money now. I want it today, tomorrow, yesterday, and five days ago. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Ronnie, this is the kid that keeps calling, by the way. It's got a name on it and a real phone number. Can you... Um... Is it trying to do like a, a bad Tommy Wright imitation? <laughs> can, you just, can, you just, it's... can you just look it up and grab his address for me? Maybe we'll have some fun with this. You can't yeah. do that. <laughs> we, have to, we have to encourage the fucking listeners to call with, not to fucking scare the fuck out of them. Yeah, but okay, but like he's using his real number and he keeps calling. Okay. He's called like leave 16 him, fucking times. Leave him, leave him alone for now. If he gets too annoying, just uh, block the number. That's it. Hello? Easy. Yes. <laughs> I don't even know who's on the line right now. It's like, I like it's all jammed up with calls. I can't even see. <laughs> Who is this? I love you. I, love you. I want to tickle you. Ragman, you, you need to do some graphics for me. You need to stop fucking around on the phone. You were supposed to make a t-shirt for me and you didn't do it. Get off the fucking phone and go do yeah, some graphics for me. Make I'm, a nice penis graphic for him, okay? I'm going to be back in England by tomorrow night, and uh, if you haven't done those graphics by then, I might fucking pop in and see you on the way home and fuck your ass up. So, uh, he, he, like, may give, he may give you a wank think, if you don't do you it. You think I'm joking and shit, but, like... I, we I, need Macronathon I'd stuff. get to work. Yeah, we have the next Macronathon coming up, so you've got to get to work Ooh. on that as well. You get... get no more prank calls until you get some work done. Get out of here, Ragman. <laughs> wow. All right? Love you, Ragman. Rag get out of here. We love you, Ragman. We love, we love you, but get to work right now. Oh, 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 yeah. Go. Stop oh, jerking yeah. off to my voice and go oh. do some work. Oh, yeah. Put the Sorry, finger I'll in go. there. Yeah. I'll go. Very much. Give me the finger, Ben Chot. Give me the finger. <laughs> <laughs> what has happened to my poor show? Don't see my wife. She is a good goat. Oh, my God. <laughs> You can't go spend some time with the wife. Can't no. do that. Get the fuck out of here. Okay, I spend my time with the wife. Right, get out of here. Get back to work now. All right, Very I good, hung yes. up on her. Yeah, it's just that feel later on. I love you. Okay, get out of here. Get out of here. <laughs> fucking hell. It's going fucking nuts. Here. Hello? Yes, I would like to hear some Google dials. Thank you. Some more Google dials. Did go, you... Google dials. Fuck it out. Go, go down. Yep. Hello, this is Buster Hyman asking Ronathan to lick my butthole. Well, that's going to cost you how much money you got. Oh, do, do, do you want to know in British pounds or American euros? American Indian euros, rupees. please. Rupees, please. Rupee. Or I rupee. have one million rupees for the pinch hole. That's not enough. That, that won't buy you a stick of gum. Get out of here. <laughs> oh, that just makes me want to stroke it. With, oh, with yeah. the bin short. Oh, my God. Yeah, reach down there. What you got in the fridge? Let's play a game. <laughs> you, have, you have a frying pan? <laughs> you have I a frying pan? <laughs> you ever heard of the beaver the tail? Roll. You ever heard of the beaver tail? Can the tail on the beaver? Can play. Yeah. <laughs> I can walk you through how to do it. That'll right quit. Not aware. Let's quit that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, now we're talking like the manhole. Hey, you want the manhole's number? I'll give it to you, buddy. If you're that interested. Oh, yeah. I'm ready. Okay. It's 1 800 get fucked. Let, let's move on to the next. Next caller, please. With without lube. <laughs> yeah, let's. Next caller, please. Goodbye. Fucking hell. Alright, no, there's no more coming in now. Oh, what have you done, Ronnie? <laughs> uh, no, okay. Let's get some fucking Ronnie, fun. Ronnie, Fuck. Ronnie.
fuck we haven't the even got the, we haven't even shit. got through the voicemails yet. That, this oh, is, I think this is Hi guys, Dale, Dale here, we here from the manhole. About time Dale come to save us. <laughs> okay, guys, I got a big problem. Fucking <laughs> oh, <okay>, hell. <laughs> Hi. You think you're so funny, you fucking goof, sitting there with that big old hat covering your fat forehead? There we go. Give it a break, you goof. Come on, give me some more. This is the best one yet. Here we go. Here we go. Come on, is this Jeff? Yeah, is that you, Jeff? My walker. Give me a second. <laughs> I knew it. I knew it. I knew it was Jeff. I knew your voice, Jeff. Get out of here, Jeff. <laughs> All right, here we go. Just no, it's always the same material with you, Jeff. Guess that he hung up. Fucking Jeff. Was, I knew that was going to be Jeff. Fuck. How many words do you think we can get out of Dale's voicemail before it rings again? Like war room. Okay, guys, I got a big problem. Uh, someone uh, took it upon themselves to take a, a hole saw and go into several of the booths here at the manhole and added additional holes. Now, the current holes we have are uh, the metric standard for the European Union, and you cannot be altering them. Uh, we'll get in big trouble. And, uh, well, just don't do it, Ronnie. Uh, anyway, got some Ronisms and uh, been tabulating these for a while, and we're coming up on number 69, which... Uh, Someone sent me a special one, but let's start out with number 67, okay? Ron Blackman once missed two days of school. Those days are now called the weekend. <laughs> we had that last weekend. time. Sure. We had that last time. Number 68. Ron once pissed in the fuel tank of a semi-truck as a joke. That truck is now known as Optimus Prime. Ooh, strong yeah, stuff there. There we go. There we go. Now... Number 69, Ron Blackman doesn't suck dicks. Dicks <laughs> suck Ron Blackman. <laughs> what does that even yeah. mean? <laughs> what? Number 70, Ron can divide by zero. Amazing. Yep. 71, no, that is Ron true. Blackman once made a Happy Meal cry. Oh. <laughs> 72, sharks have to get into a cage to swim with Ron Blackman. And number 73, Ron Blackman built Rome in one day. Amazing. True. <laughs> okay, I guess that'll do it. Toodles. Toodles. Thank you, Dale. Hello? Hi. <laughs> hey, who was that? Was that a chick? Somebody in the toilet. It's a child. <laughs> Hello? Who's the fucking kid, man? Hello? Hello? Hi, this is your pharmacist calling. How are you today? Oh, Terrible. Dick. Terrible. I've had three heart attacks today and they say I'm going to die within the next hour. How can I help? I'm just letting you know your prescription is ready for pickup. And um, I was wondering when you'll be able to come in. I can't next come week. in. I've lost the use of my legs He's and dead. soon I will He's die. Dead. Please dead. pray for me. What's the big punchline on the prescription? I have a prescription know, order right. for this phone number for a three-month supply of General Warts cream. This is for yeah, you, right? Yeah, like that was coming. Wow. <laughs> don't worry. You don't have to be embarrassed. A lot of people oh, have General Warts nowadays. Fuck off. That, that, those things suck. Don't do those. They're fucking don't fucking do boring. this fucking pre-recorded fucking bullshit. Oh. Boring. Who's next? Only real calls. Hi, hi, Hank. This is your brother, Frank. <gasps> Frank! I hope you're doing well. Frank! Um... I had to take our mother to the gynecologist the other day. Oh, my God. You remember Dr. Kunz, don't you? He says hi. Oh, well, Dr. Anyway, Kunz. Um, she was worried because she had some yeah. um, nickels and dimes falling out of her lady parts. Oh, my God. But, um, Dr. Kunz said there was nothing to worry about because she was just going through her change. Oh, my God. We'll be expecting quarters next month. Oh, <laughs> It's and the see what he did there. Over at, at Starbucks, only knew how I was getting my lattes. I think they lose your minds. Okay, well, take care. <laughs> Be careful out there. Frank, I'm so glad he called in. Wow. Hello, you know, this is Hank. Like he sounds like Kyle's cousin from South Where the fuck, Scobie? Uh, Scobie, Scobie, call for you. Scobie, you, you got to call. You got to call. motherfucker, though. Cheated me out of a bunch of money. I done placed all these bets. 
What's up, sissy? What the fuck you owe me Wait fifteen hundred dollars? Is that you? Where the fuck you at? Is that you? <laughs> is that you, Tabasco Jenkins? This ain't no goddamn Tabasco Jenkins, motherfucker. Where's Scobie at? Sound like Tabasco Jenkins. Scobie's here. Talk to him. Talk to him, Scobie. What's up, baby? Well, baby, my ass, nigga. Where my motherfucking money at? <laughs> you ain't work hard enough for a girl. What this the ain't fuck? no goddamn girl, Scobie. Let me tell you, you something. You don't kill me bitch. out the Bears game. You can get you your ass down that corner and give daddy back his money, bitch. You hear me? Who the fuck you call? Bitch, I come through this goddamn phone line and slap the black off your ass. Who the fuck you think you talking to? <laughs> bitch, you heard me. You bring me back my fucking money, ho. You know what? You know what? Let me get through this light real quick. As soon as I pull over and park, I'm going to do something to you, bitch. Oh shit, getting violent now. Holy fuck, who was that, Scobie? <laughs> Sounded just like Tabasco Jenkins, I'm telling you it was him. Scobie, I think one of your fucking corner workers fucking Yellow. left the post right now. Oh, yeah, this is Belfast. Is that you, Ragman? <laughs> not Belfast. No, no, this is Belfast. <laughs> no, it's Ray, it's Ray. <laughs> Ray. <laughs> Ray. I thought it was Ragman doing it. <laughs> I was about to say, this ain't, this ain't Belfast. I couldn't stand you. I know. I, I, I would have known if it was Belfast. This is brilliant. That was the only trademark part of this. Okay, right. We finally got the voicemails out of the way. Let's try and get the safety banchoed uh, out of the way. Safety banchoed, what are you saying this week? Before we jump in, a note on our content. The Macron Show is created for adult audiences only. We advise listener and reader discretion for graphic depictions of sex graphic situations, and some downright filthy language. If wow. you or anyone listening are triggered by this, please do not listen to the show. Let's get your the mats. content on this show is only and only for entertainment purpose and does not express the views of the show host, co-host, and management of the Macron show. All calls and information obtained herein are made for parody purposes and are not intended to be used for anything but comic purposes. You got that right, right? Oh, come on now. Uh, don't be fucking calling him playing the show. We, we know what boring, the fuck Boring, boring. Like, call in, and, call in and roast me. Where? Where's all the old school trolls, you know what I mean, Ronnie? Can we check, yeah. can we, uh, can we check in with old man? Of course. I, was gonna I know he's not going to answer. I do that anyway. Hello. 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 I got a game for you. I'll tip you ten dollars if you get it right. Done. Deal. All right. Go. Okay. You have to guess the item. All right. Okay. Okay. I get fingered a lot. Trombone. No. People love to stick me in their mouth. Toothbrush. No. Just looking at me can make a woman drool. Chloroform. No. I'm about six <laughs> inches long. Raised dick. No, not raised dick. Uh, nuts, too big. My nuts can yeah, just yeah. suck in your mouth. A Snickers bar. Peanut butter. It's a candy bar. I'll give it to you. I'm going to tip you. Snickers Yay. bar. Yay. Yeah. <laughs> Yay. Yay. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> there he goes. <laughs> <laughs> wow. I'm liking it, to be honest with you. <laughs> Fuck. You want I love it. <laughs> yes. Oh, no, they, they hung up. They hung oh. up. Oh, my God. Just, I mean, what do we do? Try and do a complainer here. Well, at this point, I want to fucking mention something else. We got 126 people watching and only 41 people thumbs up. <gasps> what? So... We need more thumbs up, people. Get your shit together. I need to refresh mine. Mine says one thumb up. <laughs> it says only one finger up, huh? Yeah. <laughs> no, it's 41 now. <laughs> it's 41 now. Yeah, mine says one. Come on, people. Hurry up. Don't let fucking Ron drown in the fucking pool. Look at him. Look at him. He's drowning. Help him out. Please help him out. Or fuck off, bitches. Oh, I am. Somebody press like. 45. More, 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 more. At least 70. At least 50. Fuck. 
か。Oh shit. I think he might be fucking passed out by now. He's dead now. That's it. Rest in peace. That was a terrible day. Hazel took that picture、um, one morning in Canada. She just <clears throat> she got up one morning really early and she came outside and that's where I was. And so before doing anything, she took a bunch of pictures. Isn't that right, Hazel? Do you remember that day? But then、before、they saved you. Then yeah. Then they had、before. someone pull you out. Well, she got her husband、yeah. to get a net, and he scooped,、yeah. he scooped me out with、she、a net. Would, she didn't、yeah. jump in and save you. She just said, "Hey, Ron,、no. you okay? Ron, Ron." It was quite、Ron. the night. It was quite the night when when that、I、was taken. I just、taken. told them not to move for the photos. Ah,、uh, yeah, basically. That's basically what I was doing all day, anyway. There's plenty of pictures. I just got a message that says, "Congratulations, you received a hundred chat messages today."、Uh, okay. Yay. Does it not?、Oh, Don't we? Oh, Doctor Charles is here. Ah,、oh, here he comes. One、there、more day, Doctor C. One more day. One more day. <laughs> <laughs> Your life's、one. gonna light right <laughs> up soon. <to. laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> well, at least give him till Wednesday. At least、He's、give him till Wednesday. He's been edging this whole time. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking hell! <laughs> Why is wrong with you people? By the way, Dale did a super chat. Chris did a super chat, and Mark Rutherford just did a. Oh, Mark Rutherford must have been the person that did the quiz because he says、uh, from the trivia game. All right, I thank you for that. Yay! We won, even though I got all the answers wrong. You owe me ten dollars. I got Snickers bar. I thought my answers were better when he was like, "What can make a woman drool just by looking <laughs> yeah, at it?" Chloroform. Motherfucker. <laughs> It's accurate. Uh, right, right. Let's try and do a complainer. I don't think if anyone calls in, it won't. It shouldn't interrupt the.、Uh, shouldn't do yeah, it. Yeah, don't call don't during. Don't call it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It shouldn't do anything. To be honest with you, it'll tell me someone's calling, but it won't ring or do anything. So like. Oh, you got that thing turned it, off. Yeah, I've got it all. Yeah. It'll just put them in a queue. Hello. Hi, Carlos. I'm calling from PlayStation. How are you doing? I'm good. How about yourself? I'm real good, thanks. Reason for the call is we noticed that you reached out to us on social media with a complaint, and we just wanted to touch base with you and find out what happened. Yeah. So、um, I, I'm not. I, I don't exactly know who I was talking to, but、uh, the individual that I was talking to, I don't know. He seemed very. He seemed very rude.、Uh, just. It, it was. It was honestly. It was just like a. I. I, I would. I'll, I'll admit. Like, a part of it was I was already、uh, kind of frustrated, considering what I was going through at the time. So I was really upset about it. But、um, I mean, I guess time passed. I, I. I guess I can't do anything about it. But I, what, I just. What, I was what, just what, really upset. What, what. What happened exactly? What got you so upset? So.、Um, so let me. I, I'll give you the. Basically, what happened? So,、right. I, my friend, he has a game, Street Fighter Five. He downloaded it on my PlayStation, and we were playing it.、Uh, it was working; it was enjoyable. Whatever. I, I was like, okay, yeah, I, I think I'm gonna buy this game. So I go to the PlayStation Store and I make the purchase. Okay, cool.、Uh, mind you,、uh, prior to making the purchase. The game worked fine. I had no issues, no problems, or anything like that. But after I had purchased it,、um, I had noticed that while we were trying to play,、uh, one of the、uh, like my friend, he wasn't able to press any buttons, and neither was I at some point. Like we we would just be sitting in like the title screen, and I'm trying to press the start button, and nothing's working. So、really? I would turn it off and turn it back on, and it would work. <laughs> but then we would get into the game, and it would start doing it again, where we couldn't really get into the match. We were just sitting there trying our best to like press into the game, and it just wasn't working. I had deleted it twice. I had reinstalled it, it, and it, the same issue was just happening. So I decided to look at the、uh, <clears throat> PlayStation. The policy、Got、and the、you. policy states, yeah, policy states that、uh, you know if the game isn't working properly, that、uh, you're eligible for a refund. So I thought、Pushed. that the issue that I was going through would constitute it being that it wasn't working properly.、Yeah. Um, but the individual that I was speaking to, 
um, told me that I had to basically contact uh, Capcom and talk to them about my issue because mm. uh, I guess I, I need a because I guess uh, the issue needs to be like something that a multiple people or a lot of people are going through in order for it to constitute as a like as the game isn't working properly and I like nothing was conveyed to me in that manner that that was what the policy was had I had known that I wouldn't have bought the game honestly um but yeah so I told him I asked him uh, I was like isn't there a one time uh uh, a one-time courtesy refund or anything like that and the dude said the dude said uh that there is but since i had played the game more than an hour okay. uh, that i wasn't eligible for it and that kind of that honestly really upset me mainly because most of the play time that i had in the game was prior to me making the purchase you know what i mean okay i'm gonna and have to um, i'm gonna purchase, have to hold on a sec i'm gonna have to stop you there Go ahead. Oh, there's no reason. I'm I'm just gonna have to stop you. Um, so uh, the problem is that you, you're not pairing your controllers to the console properly. But what I'm gonna do with you, if that's okay, is I'm just gonna go through a quick IQ test with you. It's uh, standard policy here, just to make sure everything's okay. I'm gonna ask some fairly simple questions, and I just need you to give me what you think is the correct answer. Does is that okay? Uh, no. Perfect. Actually, so an IQ an IQ test. Yes, yeah, I'm just going to do a quick IQ test. So I'm going to read out five no, words. No, no, to be honest, dude, to be honest, man, it's it's, it's really not that serious. If y'all want my $20, y'all can have it. I don't really, you know, it's Oh, the t no, 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 like that's, that's not a problem. So we are going to take care of you here today with some compensation. It's just a standard policy when I come across someone like yourself that I have to do a quick test just to... It's, it's, it's just a thing we do here. Think of it as a little game here at PlayStation, okay? So... I'm gonna yeah, but I'm not. I'm not really trying to play a game with y'all right well, I, now. No, y'all already I, played we, a game with me when y'all took my money. You feel me? Like I'm not. Well, we're gonna. I'm we're gonna resolve to that. I'm, a, I'm gonna resolve that. I'm nah, gonna resolve. Crazy. I'm gonna resolve that for you, and it only takes a few moments. I'm. Look, let me show you how easy it is. I'm gonna give you five words, and three of these words have a similar meaning, and I want you to see if you can pick out those three. So the five yeah, words. Yeah, I'm not about to sit here and play this with you, bro. I'm not doing this, man. But I just need yeah, your your boy told me he wasn't gonna help me, so I I accepted it. It's cool. It's whatever. I'm fine. But I mean, it's just like you're obviously a fairly grown man, and you can't work out how to get the multiplayer working on Street Fighter. Like no, like, but is it's everything not. It okay? wasn't the multiplayer. It wasn't necessarily the multiplayer, huh? Yeah. And I see yeah. what you're doing now. I don't even know if this is a real phone call at this point because this is absolutely ridiculous. If this is, it's ridiculous that you can't <laughs> figure out how to use your PlayStation. I mean, how are you going to get a job where you have to do like actual technical stuff and like work if you can't even well, figure look, this look, out? Hey, dude. Uh, like, hey, really? Man, if like, you're really PlayStation, this is right? ridiculous, bro. Because you sound like a the illest meat rider right now, bro. You sound like you suck really? mad dick. Right. So let me just put it like this, all right? So let me just tell you like this, all right? Y'all can have the fucking money. I don't care. Thank you. Y'all got me. It's cool, yeah. all, right? all right? Just leave me Thanks. the fuck alone, all right? I'm, a, oh, don't I'm cry definitely going to be it. letting don't PlayStation know about, about this shit, too, don't, bro. Don't cry about it. So you can it. go kiss ass. You can go suck dick. You can go do whatever. Yo, go fuck your mom. Whatever you got to do, man. Leave me the fuck alone. Oh, that's Get nice. the fuck out of here. Eat cocks. Eat cocks. I'm sorry, what? Mad dick. <laughs> I was just letting him go. <laughs> what? The buttons don't work. The buttons don't wow. work, mom. Like, how old are you, for fuck's sake? I, I, I don't know. That guy was fucking serious at some point, or he was fucking I can't fucking with do us. it. I think it gets to the screen and the buttons don't work. Like, you fucking moron. I'm going to call him back. He knew he was going to fail that IQ. He knew he was. He knew he was not. He he couldn't even spell IQ if that was the first question. Well, and he kept trying to sound smarter than I just let him dig his own grave. Please leave your message for six. Oh, poor guy. All right. Poor guy, no IQ there. If you're trying to call him, by the way, you have to kind of sneak it in between calls because otherwise we... Unless you were trying to disrupt the call because that won't... It won't. It won't work, guys. Do you want to do a quick IQ test? Next caller, who wants to do IQ test? Call in. If you want to do the IQ test with me, let me know. I want to do an IQ test. Do you? I can. We can do the first, IQ first test. First question. 
Where do you huh? find the clitoris? It's, it's more, well, it's more about how quick you can do it, too. Times, he still can't find it. And <laughs> Ray, what the sad. fuck is wrong with your wife these Ray, days? <laughs> Ray, your wife's not happy at all. <laughs> I mean, I, I could go and say something really bad, but I won't. No, do it. Say it. Say it. Yeah. Say something no. fucking awful. Do it. I You're roasting each other so husband, fucking. But I love him. He's a beautiful person, and that's the only dick I'm gonna have for the rest of my life. So I better learn it, to like it. Even if it's so small. <laughs> Do you know what? The what other... about that pink one you were shoving in Ray's mouth? <laughs> well, you know that. Luckily, I have that. <laughs> oh, fuck me. Here we go. <laughs> fuck his color. Hello. Hello. Hey there, how you doing? Uh, listen, do you have any plans this evening? Oh, fuck you with your fucking bullshit, <laughs> you motherfuckers, man. You gotta be more creative. Don't fucking play out of merit fucking prank calls and shit and whatever. Come on, stupid motherfuckers. Do you know what Karma was bitching to me the other day about Ray? Hmm? She, told she, me, she told me that she likes to talk to him after sex, but she's getting real sick of paying for the long distance calls. Oh! 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 <laughs> oh my god. Sorry. Sorry, everyone. I'm sorry. I had to do it. Uh, UPS. This person took a fucking photo of the UPS truck. You should see the many complaints she has. She's constantly complaining about people parking at her door, so I reckon she's going to be Oh, uh, no, she's got short blue hair as well. Oh, one of these so we need to get <laughs> I'm not mm -hmm. even... Hang on a minute. Now... I like her. Now, I've got no problem with people with short blue hair. It can look really cool and it can be really fun. But uh, if she also For complains sure. about everything constantly on social media, it starts to paint a portrait of uh, what's going on here. Of a Smurf who keeps complaining? She could be a Smurf. Hello. Thank you for calling Pizza Hut. Hi. How may I take your order? Yes. Uh, three large cheese, please. Three large cheese? Is this for uh, Extra delivery sausage. or carry out? Uh, both. I... It's actually going to be both, I... if that's okay. Can you ship it? Can you ship it out with FedEx? Can we get ship it out with? Can we get? No, oh. no, no, no. He's just being silly. Um, it's oh, okay. it, it, it's actually for delivery and carry out, if that's okay. Cut it in half, half of it delivery, half of it. Oh, carry out. yeah. Oh, okay. What, what, what address are we delivering it to? Uh, your address, your home address. One, two, three, five. Pizza Hut <laughs> Avenue. Is this a joke? No, it's not a joke. What do you mean it's a joke? What kind of joke? We're we're not in the joke business. What's wrong with you? I'm just trying to get this you straight. Trying? You want three large pizzas. We're dining. Look, we're, or... in case you can't tell, we're Europeans, and tonight we're dining al fresco. Do you even know what that means? Do you know? You know where it I means. Know. It means we're going to come in and collect the food, and while we're coming in to collect the food, we want your guy to go to the house and drop off the food. Does that make sense? It's pretty simple. So write okay, that down, okay, and take the order, you simpleton. He's going to deliver the pizza and us back to the house. You understand now? Yeah. Okay, that, 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 that's kind of like an Uber or a... Yeah, or a so, so when we come to collect the food... Okay, which is for delivery. You are going to give us a lift back to our house. I think that's possible for a little bit extra on the delivery. Driver. Oh, I'm not yeah, paying sure. any local. extra. He's going that way anyway. I'm going it's not going to cost big, him anymore. I'm, he's I'll going. Give him a big tip. A he's, big tip. He was going right by my house anyway. So why should I pay extra? <laughs> okay, that that's fair enough. But yeah. now let's complete the order. That's okay. Three large pizzas. <sighs> No, oh, what do you mean three large What pizzas? kind of crust would you like? Epic stuff. Can I get stuff the crust where, like, it, so it's, like, just made out of, like, standard bread dough and, like, where it goes sort of in a circle around the topping and it kind of rises <laughs> a little bit with heat? Hello? <laughs> Did some idiot really fucking <laughs> patched in a fucking pizza? 
That's the number that just called. If you <laughs> all right, where, we... <coughs> where, were... <laughs> where were we? Okay, call the fucking the snowflake with the fucking short hair. The fucking the UPS moment. lady. Yeah, I've got a feeling this this one's gonna be good. Ooh, she's a she's a cunt. Reading her fucking profile. Yeah, she does look like a real cunt. Yeah, she was on Survivor. Complaining about that left. Her? She was on Survivor. Well, yeah. yeah fuck. I, I bet she did. Oh God, day. look at. Her. Yeah, she was on Survivor. Yeah, that's what oh. I was reading. Oh, man. She is one butch bitch. Survivor 37. And she's complaining Cap about everybody. Wow. Left, Uber. Yeah, she's complaining complain about everything. UPS, oh, my God. Everything. She's just a chronic complainer, so have fun with her. I'm hoping oh. the numbers right. It wouldn't let me call it earlier, so... Oh, now you tell me. You Puerto Rico. What? Puerto Rico. Who's Puerto Rico? Oh, that's why. The number. The number. The number. I should be able to call oh, that. Those. Yeah, you should. No, I can't. Mm -hmm. What's the What's the country code? Zero plus one. You told me plus yeah. one. I thought it was Canadian because it wouldn't let me dial it. No, you try it, Ronnie. You try it for me. See if you can dial it. I might have to. There might be a way to enable uh, calls to Puerto Rico. It's probably just blocked by default. Uh, if I can fucking remember where that page is. Uh, fuck. Is it under fraud control? I think it is. <laughs> oh, wait a second. I just found out why we can't call it. <laughs> why? You're going to like this. Because they just added a new default setting. Guess what it says? Puerto Rico? No, it says that. <laughs> Maybe we'll try enabling that. No. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that might fucking help. That's why we're getting so many errors lately, you know. It's when we're trying to call fucking Puerto Rico and possibly Hawaii as well. Because um, Hawaii doesn't count as being one of the... Oh, what's happening? So I figured out why we're getting so many errors lately, Ronnie. Go look at the last picture that I put in show chat. For real, they added they added this recently. Oh yeah, I enabled my fucking shit like a week ago. I didn't even notice it. Let me try calling on air. And there we go. Well, where is the bitch at? Puerto Rico. Puerto Rico. Did she go on Survivor and then they just left? Oh, hello? Hello. Hi there, ma'am. I'm calling from the corporate liaison team at UBS. How are you doing? I'm doing great. Uh, reason for the call is that I was actually alerted to your case by my social media team. I understand you reached out to them with a problem. Uh, yes. Look, um... What happened? This more... Okay, so... There is a big issue. It's not the first time... Uh, for some reason, UPS drivers, Amazon, all delivery companies seem to do not care about the garage in my condo building, right? Mm. Today, I think you saw the picture already. This guy, even though he wasn't blocking our garage, the way he was parked, it was impossible to leave the garage without hitting something. And how long was he right. par how long was he parked there for? <clears throat> it was a while and it it doesn't how even long, matter. How long how long's a while? Right? Well, I need to know for the report, that's all. I need to know specifics. How long was he there for more, in real more, life? More than around 10 minutes. 10 minutes, okay. Okay. So your Eight complaint, ways. hold on a moment. I'm just making sure I've got everything right here, honey. So um okay. I'm just, I need to make sure I got the facts right so I can do a full report on this and have it investigated. So, because a man temporarily parked for around 10 minutes, not in front of your garage, but near your garage, um, do you want to log that as a complaint? Yes, because yeah. when I was leaving my garage after maneuvering, I still hit the poles on the side. It doesn't even matter that they're plastic. And the issue is... <laughs> That when... Sorry about that, ma'am. I uh, have a cough. <coughs> Excuse me. 
Please continue. Were you coughing or laughing? I was coughing, ma'am. I, I have COVID. Okay. Um, regardless if I could get out or not, it was very difficult to get out of my garage. He was in the middle. I saw him coming out of the building after like trying to look for him because I thought he was in the van like taking sure. out passages. Sure. So he walks out and I ask him, very politely, I was like, hey, dude, next time that you deliver here, can you park either like a little bit more to the back or to the front? Because even though you're not blocking the garage door, yeah. it is in the middle. And yeah. this is a street that is one lane each. I understand. Right? Well, what did he say to you? What was his reply? He looked at it and he's like, if you can't get out of there, then you shouldn't drive. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> I'm sorry, ma'am. There's another cough. <coughs> Damn this COVID. <coughs> Should have got vaccinated. <coughs> sorry about that, ma'am. Do, do, <laughs> so, uh, she hung up my car. Oh, my God. That's totally like fucking answer. Amazing. If you can get off, you shouldn't dive. I didn't even need to say anything. She just made herself look stupid. I didn't Thank even God. say anything. I would, love to call that, I would love to call that driver. She drove into a post. It was. I knew it was going to be good when she said he wasn't actually <laughs> parked in front of the guy. <laughs> oh no. Can, How Kezo, Kezo, can you call her and uh, just uh, <laughs> see, what, see what was with the root code that just happened? How dare another right. human being exist for 10 minutes anywhere near me? How dare he? Yeah, well, <laughs> you guys, call her back. Uh, How dare he exist? All right, Hazel, you better call her. Say that What's your name? L Larissa? <laughs> Fucking who knows? Larissa, I don't know. whatever. Huh? Karen. <laughs> Miss Joris. Okay. <laughs> you deal with her. I can't. UPS? <laughs> yep. UBS. Just say UBS. UBS. She, di she didn't okay. catch it when I said that either. <laughs> Your call has been forwarded to voicemail. No, please, no, come back. We're sorry. Come back, talk some more. <laughs> Just tell us more about your adventures. Oh <laughs> it was parked in the garage, but not actually in a front. But this fucking dumb. You can tell that she's angry that it was a man as well. Like, if it had been a female driver, this would have been resolved. But it was a man that did this to her as well. Fucking yeah. feminist practically raped. Us. She's practically been raped, okay? What she's and she say. realizes the <laughs> stupidity of the whole situation and she's embarrassed. She she's going to be considered as a capital punishment. If she's washing the hair thing. die out right Your now. Has been to right now. <laughs> Tears <laughs> down her face in the shower head. <laughs> All right, oh I'm gonna God. I'm gonna stop being a cunt. <laughs> my she days have been a cunt are over. She's, <laughs> called, she's calling the activist right now. Your call has been forwarded to voice now. Why can't UPS? Taking all these Justin Bieber posters down right now. <laughs> Let's change everything. Did you, did you call uh, San Carlos? Why would you have is not in service? <laughs> PlayStation. She's yeah, from PlayStation. Yeah. Okay, what? He, just, he just tweeted, PlayStation oh my calls, God. calls people to harass them now. <laughs> all calls, y'all don't have good customer service. And he posted the number you call from PlayStation. <laughs> It really is just a night of geniuses tonight. This is fucking Good. great. Here is a the people are taking care of themselves. Um, Larissa may have just roasted herself so badly that she's deactivated her phone already. Oh. Listen. It's trying to dial now. I think she might have plugged the... Oh no, it's ringing. It's ringing now. You talk to her if she picks up, Hazel. She's hanging her blue head in shame. Secret Agent Barfago says, I wrecked her so bad. I didn't say a single thing. She wrecked <laughs> just... herself. Your call has been forwarded. I just <laughs> let her tell me what she did. I think, this, I think in this one case, you really didn't do anything. She just, I didn't listen. do anything. I, got, no, I crashed didn't... into a post and then the driver said I couldn't drive. <laughs> I shouldn't be driving. If I can't get out, I shouldn't be driving. <laughs> 
There was nothing for us to <laughs> I say. I had she nothing to do with the whole incident. <laughs> nothing. <laughs> she <laughs> took care a, of the whole thing. I was just an independent observer to that whole thing. Oh, wow. Oh, fuck Belfast. That was a great number. Well done. It's well not done your fault you have a COVID cough. She took a picture of his truck as well, and it's just parked in the middle of the street. Like, how else is he meant to deliver the packages? He's got to get there somehow. Like, he's physically got to... Your call has been forwarded to voicemail. He's physically allowed to do his job, like, you know, in 10 minutes. Like, all right, whatever. I'd be more annoyed if I was driving and I was stuck behind him because he's just stopped oh in the middle God. of the street. But, I mean, you just drive around, you know, it's not rocket science. Come he on, said, people, please... the line is open, Cohen, motherfuckers. He said, please teach your drivers that garage doors and driveways need to be respected. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> they have feelings as well. <laughs> Did he... Do you think the driver mis misgendered her driveway as well? That's a female driveway. Oh, so. maybe, maybe. <laughs> I was, was going to say something like that, yeah. <laughs> that is a female driveway, so are you. Every Ain't week no we pronouns. have this issue. It's another and those form drivers, of rape. <laughs> she said every week we have these issues and your drivers get aggressive. <laughs> <laughs> like, fuck off. Fuck off, oh, boy. They'd probably, <laughs> probably look at the address and be like, oh, fuck, this yeah, bitch again. This fucking bitch just sitting at home all day yelling at delivery drivers. <laughs> oh, what a fucking dickhead. And oh, she I'm was sorry. on Survivor? Yeah. How does she last a day? I don't know. I don't watch that dumb shit. Well, she's in Puerto Rico right now. I was wondering if that's where they had Survivor and they just left her there. <laughs> <laughs> she's, she thinks she's still on the show. They were like, to, okay, okay, Larissa, today's challenge is going to be a big game of hide and seek. Now run into the jungle. And she ran off and they were like, start the chopper, start the chopper, go. That's five like, you years were, ago. <laughs> that was five years ago. She's still there. <laughs> wow. Stop being us right now, man. Oh, come on, she did it to herself. We did nothing. Fucked up, blue care, motherfucker. I'm not being funny, but her parents were probably disappointed that she did survive. <laughs> 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 they were the ones that sent her there. <laughs> like, that was a. That was maybe. a. Maybe. <laughs> Yeah, that wasn't in the script. You were supposed Producers, to die, hey, Producers, Producers, Sorry, I wasn't available. Producers told us you're not coming back. <laughs> okay. There is no show. <laughs> she wasn't on Survivor. Her family just had a whip round. <laughs> told her she was on Survivor. <laughs> Got a that fake producer. When it, when it was that, uh, not the tornado. What the fuck? They had the tsunami shit. There's just yeah. a bunch of fake plastic cameras on the beach and her talking to them. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Dale says she played a gay card the whole way. Hey, this is Derek's phone. Sorry, yeah, look at this fucking dude here. You can give me a call back. What the fuck is this? That's the fuck fast is calling her. That's what we call her. Oh shit. Call her now. Who's Who calling what? Do? Who's doing what? That's, that's the one we calling now. A picture bug fast posted. Oh, wait, hold on. Derek. Oh, fuck me. What? Oh. Yeah, <laughs> look at it, dude. What? can't stop laughing. What is going on tonight? It's a fucking I don't know. Picture. Amazing. <laughs> oh, my God. I can't stop laughing. Wait, this dude's an actor. Yeah, I've just noticed that too. Hey, this is Derek's phone. Derek, Derek, please talk to us. I'm going to call him one more time. Derek. Leave he, him a voicemail. He look, he, nah, I don't like leaving voicemails hey, anymore. Cause phone? I don't like leaving voicemails in case later on we really fuck the person up and then they've got my voice recorded. I mean, they can record it anyway, but it's just giving them, you know what I mean? It's making it well, too, we'll need to too, e again. too easy. It's too much cases. evidence, you know? Mm -hmm. well, uh, he's definitely one for the call back later. He looks fucking great. Yeah, make it. Let me, let me put the international I'll symbol see. of call this person back on it. Hold on. There it is. Little phone. Okay. 
Hi, Sherry. This is Ronathan calling from the Corporate Liaison Team at UBS. How are you doing? I'm good. How are you? I'm great, thank you. Reason for the call is I was actually alerted to your case by my social media team. Uh, I understand you reached out to them with a complaint? Yes, I was at the office this morning, very um, upset the fact that I called your 800 number for customer service, repeatedly um, stated that I needed help with a package, and it said, track your shipping, track your shipping, and I said, I didn't want to track my shipping. The question I needed could not be answered by your automated assistant. And at no point in time could I speak with a person. I tried for 45 minutes. I tried to call my local UPS store. They gave me the same number. Mm -hmm. So it's very mm -hmm. disheartening when as a corporation, we utilize your company every day. Mm -hmm. And when I need assistance, I can't get it. I understand completely. So what has happened there, and we have had a number of complaints about this, but um, earlier, well, at the back end of last year, the, uh, the, the corporate decided to implement an AI-based customer service system, um, which actually uses a number of algorithms to direct customers to the correct place. But it has what we what we call a Karen filter built in, basically. We have a Karen filter built in. and Oh, I, I was being a Karen today, and it was filtered. Yes, out, yeah. So it what it will do like is if you urgent. if you yeah. start doing the whole Karen yeah. thing, it will just redirect you to a dead end until you kind of grow up and start, you know, being normal. Mm -hmm. So, right. well, and you will find I a lot of companies are implementing that at the moment. Well, they're going to lose a lot of business because I have a five thousand dollar only from, motor. Only from Karen's. Only from Karen's, though. And the problem is that our financial director has done a full assessment of this, and we've realised that the Karens that take up all the time on the customer service line and complaining and going on social media, they are not profitable. They're like a cancer, and it's better just to cut them out, focus on the actual regular customers. And so that's why your inane, foul whining is just being ignored when you call in. Do you understand what I mean? Hey, and why are you being rude to me? I have a five thousand dollar motor that mm -hmm. I ship. And this is precisely why the filter is being triggered. You see, you're falsely accusing me of being rude. You're making boastful claims about how much money you've got, and this is precisely what's triggering the filter. First of all, I didn't make any boastful comments about how much money I had. I said we. Spent yeah, you did twice already. Five thousand pound dollars. I know. Five thousand dollars. I know. Yeah, yeah. You keep going on about it. I know. I know. We've heard. Okay. What is your name? My name is Ronathan. This is usually my script is telling my AI script is telling me that you're about to ask for the manager. Is that right? Uh, we have an AI no. now, and it can actually predict what you're about to say next. So you you're about well, to your say. AI is wrong. It's telling me you're about to say you are extremely rude. I shouldn't be treated like this. Let me speak to your manager, please. Oh, she hung up. Oh, damn it! They don't like the new AI system at all. <laughs> Let me call her back and. Maybe we'll bring Hazel in as a supervisor straight away for him. Your call has been forwarded to an automated... I wasn't rude at all. I very professionally explained to her that AI is going to do away with Karen's. I spent $5,000. UPS wipes its ass with your five thousand dollars, Karen. No, well, she did. Hello. Hello. Hi, ma'am. So, just to let you know, the AI has already found a supervisor for you. Her name is Hazel, and she'll be taking over your case. Uh, Hazel. Hi. Hazel, here's the Karen. Oh, hi, this is Hazel speaking. How may I help you today? Okay, Hazel. Who was I just mm -hmm. speaking with? You were speaking with Ronathan. And who is Ronathan? He's a customer it's service he, representative. Okay, and the fact that he called me a Karen, UPS allows that? Um, no, ma'am, I don't think, no, we're not no, allowed to did. call her customer. He goes, here, no, I'm going to give no, you this Karen. No, no I, I think what he... I actually have somebody on the other line with me right now, and they're listening to this conversation. Okay, well, let me, let's, me okay. Yeah, I, I don't think he was calling you a Karen. I think what he was trying to relay was you got caught up in the Karen filter. 
I don't think he was specifically well, calling he said, you. Here's the Karen because I hung up on him because I called him rude. He was being mm-hmm. terribly rude to me. So I've got somebody else on the line, and they were listening because for some reason I got a third party. And I just mm-hmm. said I was very upset that for 45 minutes today I needed to speak with someone. And here's what caught his mind. Here's what he was rude to me about. I said, we shipped a motor that's about $5,000 that needed to be at a lo- location today. We couldn't track it. I couldn't speak to somebody. He goes, oh, there you go, throwing all your money around. I go, I- I'm just telling you the value that it was important that I spoke why to would the ma- why would it why, why would it matter if it was a $5 item or a $5,000 well, $5, item? Exactly my point, but I'm like, it was very Well, then why did you say it 17 part- times? I didn't say it 17. Why you are you said it four. Like, you I said it four. Twice. Okay. Well, you are triggering okay. every filter in the Karen filter. So it, it kind of puts okay, me on high alert. I apologize. I guess I don't understand. Why are you saying that Karen filter? It's our, because it's our Karen AI customer. bot. I'm sorry. It's our Karen AI bot. And what it does is it's able to pick up the tone of the voice the nature of the complaint and certain words, and then it puts you in that, and then it just puts us on high alert so that we know what to expect. We know to expect like okay. a high voice you, kind I'm of. I'm going to be honest with you. Had, had Thank I not you. had to fight through 45 minutes this morning of trying to reach somebody, then mm-hmm. I wouldn't even be to this point now. And I'd actually given up because I'm like, well, I, I'm just going to file a, um, a, a, rep- a rep- We actually sent a person to, here's the problem. We sent a, lo- mm-hmm. a person to, at our location so that this equipment would be there. I have the sign in that. the state form that says my, that your my Karen bot, it up. My Karen bot's telling me that the next thing you're going to do is threaten to um, file a complaint against no, uh, I'm on not this gonna delivery. File a compl- against you on the delivery? No, not against me. Against about the delivery. No, on the if it's not if it hasn't okay. Nobody will let me finish. I don't give a Well, see, you just like when filter. when you say finish, it does not it doesn't hit the AI filter, but when you go finish like that, it triggers it like okay, I well, can't. Uh, ma'am, just to let you know, she's now triggered the Veruca salt filter. Oh no. Oh, she hung up for that. <laughs> Daddy, I want to know. But I don't want it to do that. Daddy. <laughs> I didn't finish. It's not what I Daddy, wanted. Like, like, she sounded like, like, ab- like, I don't want to just like say Karen, but like that. Yeah, that Karen. That was a oh Karen. That was a hundred percent Karen. That was a classic that Karen. Yeah, I want to talk. <laughs> like, <laughs> she was so much of a Karen that even when I called her a Karen and said that the AI had detected she was a Karen and needed a supervisor, she talked to the supervisor and didn't say, oh, fuck off like a normal person would. That's how much of a Karen she was. Amazing. We had some really amazing people tonight. Uh, right? the, the next one is a hardcore football fan, so Scobie needs to get on this one. Oh, okay. Scobie, you want to start a call? I know you can do it. A hardcore Steeler fan, Scobie. Steelers fan. Oh, hardcore. Read they never call. pick up, but yes. What company? Uh, Spirit Airlines, right? That one? Yeah. The okay. guy. Yeah. He's a hardcore Steelers fan. What's, what's, can you put the complaint in check? Uh, it's yeah. actually in the chat if you scroll up. Someone copy it for him. I'm just going to set it up. Uh, lost eight hundred dollars. Uh, we don't really know the specific complaint. He just says he's out eight hundred dollars. Give me a second. Spirit. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Give me, give, give me a second. I'm gonna copy it. And put it. <clears throat> Tell him you're gonna take that eight hundred dollars and buy the Steelers a new quarterback. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. There you go. <laughs> Ah, uh, spirit. All, all his pictures on, on his profile is about Steeler, so. Oh, and he kind of looked like a little thug, too. 
Welcome to Verizon Wireless. The number you dialed oh, has been changed. Disconnected. Scoby, you oh, fucking boy. called it as well. Oh, you boy. fucking called it. Ah, bad the sports time. calls like the ones I look forward to. They, they never fucking pick up. It seems to happen to Scoby every time we get the perfect call hey, for Scoby. The number Buckfast never fucking that, works. Buckfast said that number worked for you. Worked I worked, number, him, I worked this morning because I talked to him. I woke him up at bed at three a.m. and four a.m. and five a.m. Really? Maybe well, maybe that's a. why they've changed the number. <laughs> 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 I verified them all during the night. Well, obviously it's early for me, but. Obviously, the time difference. Just checking how much that call to that woman in Puerto Rico cost me. Cost about a dollar fifty, so it's a little bit more than a normal US call. It was worth it, but that means worth totally it. Totally worth it. Let me just try his number again and make sure. But yeah, he's... welcome to Verizon Wireless. Yeah, he's fucking done with our shit. Some of them aren't happy when you wake them up. Like, but I have to understand, but. Just tell him you're calling from Spirit Reason? to check that this number still works and you'll be calling him later and then, and then hang up. <laughs> but, it is, but it's during the night third time. Good. <laughs> you're just doing a bit of customer service reconnaissance work in the middle of the night. Just go with it, okay? All right, let's, handle, let's do this Comcast motherfucker here. Don't want to talk about it. If an issue with their foot, the company under their foot. I've never called the phone number before. It's definitely the right number. Yeah, they're just being they're just being pricks mm. about it. One hundred percent. It's very hard to call this Comcast because you. Oh fuck me! Someone's calling. Hello. Yo, what's up? What's going on? Hey, it's my liquor guy with gloves. What's up? <laughs> Fuck, it's my <Mal> liquor guy. <laughs> yeah, I just want to say hi. I love your show. How long have you been listening to the show now, bro? How long ago is it since we pranked you? It's got to be like seven or eight years or something crazy, right? It was uh, two, 2016. Really? Holy shit. That's when eight. I lived in Arizona, remember, with, uh, whenever we, you pranked me with that chick? That's nearly nine years we prank called you, dude. Holy shit. Thank you for sticking around, man. That's pretty amazing. Holy shit. We should do like a yeah. little... When it gets to ten years, we should do a little celebration. Yeah, we can do something. There Maybe we go. party or drink. We can go on live on your channel, probably. All right, there we go. Ten years celebration, all right? Yeah, well, and I can, I can go on camera, too. Oh, what shit. You on today? What you drinking on today? Hurricane malt liquor. Oh. Oh, Ten years later, dude's still on the malt liquor. There we go. There I we know. go. This guy knows he's living the dream. All right, thanks for calling in, buddy. I don't want to waste your time. No, nah, no, nah, we love you, buddy. We love you. Thanks for sticking around, honestly. I, I appreciate you, man. I'm glad you're still out there doing your thing. No problem. Do your thing, too. All right, take care, man. Later. Bye. Peace. Malt liquor guy. Fucking nine, coming up to nine years this year, we prank called him. <laughs> oh, no way. Was he a complainer, was he? Not even a complainer. He was uh, selling shit on Craigslist. He was selling gloves. He was selling latex gloves on Craigslist, wasn't he, DS? Who remembers? I don't fucking remember. Yeah. We made the banner from Discord one time. Yeah, and we had, him, we had him walking down the highway with a bunch of gloves that he was going to meet us at the fucking gas station or something. We, we just fucked around with him for a bit. <laughs> That's my recollection of it, anyway. All right, anyway, let's see here. Fuckity fuck. All right, fuck that Comcast complainer. Uh, let's try... <laughs> Dr. Charles, that's so funny. Let's try the Verizon one. Hmm. Hi, who's 508 Whoa, shut up. <laughs> fuck, fuck you, button right away. She must right. be tired of I woke her up. Hi, Bastard. Hi, who's 508 when you order Macron from Wish. Yeah, that picture of the guy. Yeah, that's, that's a cool. bad version of me. All right, the next Hi, one is Belfast. Wants to to. Belfast wants you to call this number for real. He wants to fight this bitch. Which one? The next one. The oh, one. this one. I'm very interested. The one... Uh, 
Is I've been waiting for this one to come up. Delta. The rest. Okay, so this fucking complaint is amazing. So this lady's a wrestler. I've never heard of her, but I, you know, I I'm stopped. I've heard about once or twice. I I don't like any wrestling that happened after 1993 personally. Um, Patricia. So she was on a Delta flight. I tell you the story. Wait, is her real name Patricia? A real name. Is I guess Patricia. it's a fake wrestling. Yeah, a real name, name is, but yeah. yeah, wrestling name's a fake name. Okay, so she was on a Delta flight. She looked down at the floor and she noticed brown stains on her shoes and that the floor was squishy and wet in the first class cabin. They gave her gloves and towels to try and clean it. Happy birthday to me. And uh, it looks like there's shit all over the floor. Yeah, it's all kind of fucking shit spilled on the floor. She's walked shit, her... basically walked shit in onto the plane on her shoe. That's Must what be what... I'm going to accuse her of shitting herself. Um, <laughs> no, I'm hoping it works. Spilled... I haven't tested the numbers, so... Accuse her of stealing, uh, sport, uh, spilling shit all over and blaming the airline. Is she in, like, WWF, then? WWE? Uh, she's in TNA. What's TNA? Oh, yeah. It's uh, another promotion. I've heard of that. She, but I've only never, heard of it. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know her that good. I just thought... I've she never was on heard WWE. of her. She was on the Royal Rumble a couple months ago. She was at the Royal Rumble, really? Yeah, yeah. Oh, shit, really? Yeah. Hello? Hello? Oh, I thought you were doing a call. So I call? Uh... Yeah, I was wondering if it was someone we tried to call from my own number, but it wasn't. It was just someone fucking around. Someone fucking around. If you're gonna call in, at least, like... At least say something. Give me some shit, you know. Do you remember the days when there were actual trolls calling in DS? Oh, I used to love that. Fuck you, Macro. <laughs> I used to love that shit. You remember when we used to call into other people's show? I've never done that before. I didn't. Somebody else did. Somebody else did. I never did that. They were getting mad. Delete us from, uh, ban us from chat. No. All right, I'm calling the wrestler lady. I'm just going to tell you about a complaint that she shit her pants. Your call has been forwarded to voicemail. Person you're trying to reach. He's probably not gonna answer. Please leave your message. Hello? She doesn't realize she picked up. Let's just, uh... Should we just listen to what's going on? Oh my god, another Delta passenger had shit on the ceiling. Hello? Hello? I don't remember it being that many. 27 dresses.
No, uh, I'm getting fucking. Who the fuck are you listening to? Some wrestler who oh. didn't realize she picked up. Ghostbusters, what do you want? Hello? Your call has been forwarded to. What? What? Get out of here. What the fuck's going on? I don't understand anything. <clears throat> Call the other chick with the shit on her phone. Since I've got the Delta number set up, I might as well. Let's see what harp on. Oh, they got one right, right above it too. Coco Loco did a tip. He said, check your DMs, Playboy. I don't see any DMs. Alright, King Bowen. Don't start me on that. Start Ronnie on that. You guys heard the fucking King Vong? Don't fuck, no, look, fucking mention it. I looked him up yesterday and I was like, what the fuck is this crap? Hello. Hi there, Macron. Hi. You fat fucker. Listen, yeah, I got a suggestion for the show. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, listen, um, when you're, like, calling out, it's really fucking loud in my ears, and it, like, hurts and shit, so turn that down. Oh, Don't fuck tell him. me what to do. Get the fuck out of here. Make it louder yeah. now. Yeah, I'm gonna make it louder. You up. shut up. Louder. You shut louder. up. Louder. Fuck louder. you, man. Who Your do you think you are? Fucking blinds me. That's it. I'm fucking coming over there, when Ronnie. The goddamn light shines off it. How many pieces do you want tonight, <laughs> dick shit? <laughs> well. You're fucked! Talk to Hazel, yeah, Hazel. Da, 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 da. To da, 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 da. Hazel is the guy that said you have no teeth. No, he said I had to put my teeth in, and then he backpedaled. He backpedaled like a bitch, uh, like a baby. Talk I to really guy like your voice, you. Hazel. Thank you. I like you, whoever you are. Can you come over? <laughs> <laughs> Can I get your address? Yeah. It's three three four seven four four six nine six nine. That's, That's not, not an address. address. That's stupid. Okay. That's just some numbers. That's silly. That's mm. our number. That's the your number, number, dipshit. Oh. Dumbass British motherfucker. Dipshit. <laughs> 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 All right, fuck him off. Right, fuck right, off. You, fuck off. Fuck off. Fuck uh, off. Never like that guy. Too, suck a dick. Who does? Well, it's your daddy. when I ask Speak. a question, I want an answer. Speak. All right, bye. This is your daddy. Quick, let's try and get a call in before any more of these maniacs call in. I want to hear what was his dream last night. Your call has been forwarded to voice. Dream. Why? That you was your hear. dreams. You don't hear my dream. Tell mm. me about your dreams. I don't remember. I had yeah. a dream. Hello? Hello? Hey, this is Ronathan calling from Delta. Am I speaking with Edward? You're, are you speaking with Edward? Yeah. No, sorry. Oh fuck, did I call the wrong number? I'm sorry. Um, I'm calling about your complaint anyway. Um, so I don't usually do this stuff over the phone, so if you give me a call, the number I can call back or something like that, then I will do that. Oh yeah, it's just the number on your caller ID. There's quite a long wait at the call center right now, but I can give you a reference number to quote when you call in. Okay. Uh, so your reference number is going to be 80085. Um, 0085? Yeah, my, okay. name, my name is Ronathan. So when you call back, just quote that number and they'll be able to open the case file for you. Okay. All right. Uh, Thanks, bye. All right. Dipshit. Thanks. Damn it. He wasn't going to phone for me. Hello? 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 Oh, my God. I fucking love you, show. Oh, my God. Who's this? Oh, my God. Are you like a like an ex-hacker, bro? I think you rode a bike at my ass. 
Oh my God. What? Are you oh, like? No, you a hacker, man. You a IP. Are you male or female? I really. Don't do a Ben Jolson mother so good. Yo, I love your fucking uh -uh. show though, bro. That shit makes <laughs> me laugh, dog. How did you get your voice to go that high? Oh, you mean like that? That's oh, pretty. Oh, like that. <laughs> Holy shit. He shoved the carrot up his ass. Shit. He shoved the carrot yeah, up his ass. This... I told you it's Gobi. I used to tie around, man. <laughs> this guy, oh, this guy does it. all the voices. Oh, Maybe we need to get him on the show. Hey, yo, bro. Yeah, bro. Mm. Yeah, bro. I fucking love your show, dog. That shit's hilarious. <laughs> oh, thanks, dude. Da, 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 da. <laughs> da, 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 da. Da, 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 da. <laughs> Don't do drugs, kids. Don't do drugs. Or that, or that may happen. So let me hear, you, let me hear your best Ronnie voice, buddy. Do a Ronnie let voice. Do a Ronnie voice. Do a Ronnie voice. Ah, uh, fuck. Isn't he uh, Canadian or... I can't do a French one. Yeah, what? Canadian, no, yeah. he's Rus like Russian. Russian. They got you bled to Tuka, don't be shame get Tabi be Ben Jot. Yeah, that. that was pretty good. Well done. <laughs> I didn't see that yeah, coming. Like <laughs> All right, there we go. There we go. I like that. Okay. All right. Anyway, get fucked. Oh. Thanks for calling. Yeah, Chodu. Bye, Chodu. Got rid of him. Oh, what a nice call. What's this person bitching about here? What's this Final Fantasy one? GameStop. Is that GameStop that did it? I think he didn't receive his hat or something. He must have got a free this hat. This person... Free order. This... Now, you guys... I'm sorry. You guys say I'm a nerd. This guy went driving around to get a Final Fantasy baseball cap. Just because it says Final Fantasy VII Rebirth on it. Now, come on. Come on. Now You're he, worse than that. No, You're worse than no, that. No, no, yes, no. Look at this. Yes. Look at that shitty hat. I haven't even... I haven't even bought the game yet because I've been too busy living the dream. So, no. Hello? Ah, yes. More. That's more. a truck. That's is that trucker? Hyundai. Is that you truck? Is that you trucker? That's, That's a, a Hyundai. That was a fucking truck. That was an actual truck. Someone in a truck listening to the show. Yes, I like that. Um. Anyway, GameStop. We need more car horn. Yeah. If you want to call in and blast your car horn. Uh, if you can't think of anything else to do when you call in, blast your car horn at me. If you if you drive a train, fucking call us right now. <gasps> if you drive a train or a tank, if you're in a tank. <laughs> yeah, I don't think the train's got a fucking horse. <laughs> if there's anybody listening live right now and you're like doing some cool ass job, like you're in the military and you get to drive a fucking tank or a big ass truck or something fucking cool or fighter jet. If you're in a fighter jet and you're listening right now, call in. I would, yeah. I would be all over that shit. You can talk for as long as you want. I want to know. I want to get someone to call in from a tank and then fire the tank, like shoot the tank at something. And I want to choose the target. How cool would that be? Just get them to like FaceTime the controls and I'll tell them when to press fire. If you're in a tank right now, do it. Do that. Call in and do it. It'll be amazing. Well, Any target. I get to pick any target. <laughs> you want to kill yourself, really? <laughs> no. There's no such thing as innocent people. <laughs> no, but I mean, you know, I'd probably just blow up a big rock or something, you know. But I want to do it. I want to, I want to say fire, and then, and then I want to hear it go. Poof. That'd be the best. We used to get people to shoot their guns on the show, Ronnie. We did that a few times. Yeah. Yeah, we had we had one guy that. He was Remember like, a, the bushes? Oh, dude. Automatic voice message. There was one guy that thought I was hiding in the bushes in his garden and he, start, and he started was that a firing. Comcast complaint? Was yeah, that Comcast, it's, it's Comcast. Yeah. yeah, and he started firing it. He's firing his gun into the bushes. I thought Ron was in the bushes. Yeah, you could hear the oh, gun going was, off uh, too. That was uh, ATT. Same thing, more or less. ADT, 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 ADT. Oh, that was it. The alarm system. ADT, yeah, ADT, yeah, yeah. The dude started shooting at me. That was a Comcast one with me shoot though. Remember that? Maybe we had more than one. I don't remember a Comcast. I remember the ADT. It might have been. It might have been on Patreon or something. Like your call has been forwarded. Or oh, it might have been one of those calls that we never, never played. Somebody got killed. Huh? Yeah.
No, this person don't want to talk about it. Wow. Your call has been forwarded. Alright, let's do this Best Buy one. I just kind of realized that since it's my last full night here in Canada for a little while, I should order something good to eat from uh, somewhere that I won't be able to eat from for ages. What should I get tonight? And then you're stuck back here and there's fuck all. Fuck all. You're stuck. Oh, yeah, what are you going to miss the most? Tim Hortons, Wendy's, Taco Bell. Mm, I haven't really had Taco Bell. Tim Hortons and Wendy's 100%. Hello? Get you, get you. Hey, this is Shane with Ernard Twitter. How are you? Hey, how are you doing? Good. Just saw you guys might have some questions. See how I can help you out. Uh, yeah, about what? I what, have questions. I have about qu what? We have some questions, yeah. Yeah, what can I do for you? I have this rash uh, just like sort of around the taint. And when I scratch it, it gets very angry. Um, any recommendations for that? I don't have any recommendations for that, honestly. I wish I did, though. I'd love to help you out. Oh, ah, okay. Um, you, I, got a you... I got a question. Sure. Go have you kissed your wife yet today? No, I've not. You kissed her yesterday. I'm going to assume this number that whoever put this lead in is not correct. Because if you kiss your wife, <laughs> I want to know how my I want to know how my dick tastes. You assumed correctly, sir. Usually, <laughs> usually assumption is a bad idea, but in this case, you are a hundred percent correct. Well, it's good to no, know I'm correct. All right, you take care, buddy. You too. All right, bye. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody in chat is him. asking I have to tell him is on a porn correctly. set with the Mexican midgets. Should they call in? I will say yes. Please call in. Let the midgets talk to Scobie. Scobie hasn't talked to a midget in a long time. I was actually having this discussion with Hazel the other day. Um, Karma, yeah, to answer your question. No, having evaluated basically all the fast food in Canada. Well, all the fast food in Toronto. I know it gets different everywhere you go. But I do have like a top five places uh, to eat. If you like fast food. I'm not talking about like the upscale good let's restaurants hear, or whatever. Let's but, hear um, let's hear Wendy's is the best place to go if you want a burger and fries. Wendy's. Okay. Um, unfortunately, their burgers are better than NW's burgers. Not, not disagreeing with that. And Harvey's. Wendy's are just great. They're consistently great. They also have chili, yeah. uh, like biscuits, baked potatoes, chicken tenders, lots of different things that you can mix up. So, like, it's not just like McDonald's where it's always burger and fries. You can get a burger and a baked potato and some chili and mix it up. You know, there's a lot of variety going on, and the burgers are good, which is why I put it at number one. A and W is good, but their burgers are very dry. Really fucking dry. Oh no. Is this you, A and W? Hello? Hello? Uh, hi, can I help you? Yeah. Uh just listening to you from Asia. Really? Whereabouts? Uh Southeast Asia. I'd I'd rather not say. Okay. You know, that's cool. That's cool. Thank hey. you so much. That's awesome. I love I, I love my South Asian people. I used to fuck a lot of them back in the day. <laughs> Fucking wow, dear. Oh, they think fondly of you too. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Oh my god, thank you Wait. so much for calling in. What time is it there? Yeah. Uh seven forty seven Tuesday morning. Oh really? <laughs> Jesus. Okay. Damn. Wow, yeah. that's crazy. But, uh, I, I, I just wanted to tell you that uh, I used to make calls in the late 90s, and it was right when pagers were coming out, Okay. and we uh, listened to people on their cordless phones on the police scanner. Oh, I remember those days. Yeah, I used to do that too. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. That was, Amazing. That, that was fun. You could... You could build up a relationship over weeks. But then but then you grew out of all that stuff, right? <laughs> like kind of childish no. crap. <laughs> no, no, I got arrested. Oh, shit, really? You did? Yeah. Oh, yeah. wow, wow. And was that, were you living in somewhere in Asia when that happened? No, no, I was living in the United States. Oh, okay, I see. Yeah, because I could, you've got a very American accent, I can tell. Yeah, so, all right, keep okay. up the good work, guys. Thanks. Appreciate it. Thanks for calling in. We love you, man. Take care. Love, love Asia. You too. Bye. Bye. Oh, from Asia. Nice That's guy. cool as fuck. Tuesday morning at like seven o'clock. That's crazy. Um, I love my Asian people. I love my Asian people. All right. So yeah, uh, Wendy's. If you want burger and fries, 
Uh, Tim Hortons, I'm putting right up there. Tim Hortons is amazing. It's not like it's not like objectively the best fucking food, and it's not even the best coffee that you can get. But it's fast and it's consistent and it's really cheap. You're talking. You can get a large double double for what two dollars fifty, which is so much cheaper than anywhere else, even the mom and pop places, and they're fast as well. So like. You got to think realistically. When you want a coffee and you're out and about, you want it fast, right? You just you want a quick coffee. You don't want to be standing in line at Starbucks for 15 minutes to pay fucking eight dollars for a coffee. Well, when I want coffee, right? I want coffee. I don't want to fucking yeah, piss. Yeah, that's why Tim Hortons is good. You can get like they do these great breakfast wraps. It's all ready like straight away, like McDonald's. So, like you want a breakfast wrap and a coffee, it's like done. There you go, get out. Like it's so fast and it's really cheap as well. And that's why. So it's a double double coffee or. A... Uh, a, a double double is a coffee with two sugars and two creams. Uh, double double. I don't know. I don't drink coffee, so. And that's the way to do it. I drink the decaf double double, but it's still nice. Um, yeah, fucking shit. Shut up. Um, what else? Uh, Sunset Grill. I think that's only in Toronto, but if you're in Toronto and you want breakfast stuff, it's the best place for breakfast stuff by far. And again, it's really fast and it's really cheap and it's really nice when you go in and it's like. You just want to grab some fucking waffles and sausage and bacon and stuff. You go in there. It's on your table in five minutes. You know what I mean? You order a coffee and she just pours it for you. Like, right there. So, yeah. Uh, Sunset Grill is up there. What else did I decide? Hold on. I've got to open my Uber Eats now to look. Fat Bastard Burrito. That was the other one. If you want burritos and you're in Toronto, that's my favorite burrito. And again, it's cheap. It's like cheap. And it's cheap. Shwarma. Um, yeah, what's that one called? Shwarma Brothers? The big Brother Shwarma. Shwarma, no, Shwarma, Shwarma Bros. Sh Shwarma Bros. Shwarma yeah. Bros, yeah. If you want... Uh, you know what Shwarma is, right? It's just like meat. It's just like some meat, but you can have it with salad or french fries and shit like that. And again, I'm basing a lot of these off the price as well. Like, for real. You know, like... There is really good barbecue places here, but it's expensive. For, you know, it's not the kind of thing you're going to get fairly regularly. But like, yeah, those are my choices anyway. The uh, the McDonald's is the same as it is everywhere. And like Burger King and everything else. So that's my choices. But Wendy's, Wendy's is the place to go, honestly. And the Baconator is the best fast food burger. You seem to like that Papa John's pizza. Papa John's is really good here. Papa John's is very good. Papa John's is always on point. Like D Domino's always seem to get your order wrong. Papa John's never get my order wrong. Like never once. I've like customized pizzas and asked for dips and shit like that. Never once has anything been wrong from Papa John's. Same with Tim Hortons. I've ordered t like Tim Hortons for like multiple people with like all different orders and you know some want sugar and some and like it's always on point. Which is good, you want that, you know. So I'm basing my ratings on that a little bit, not just like the quality of the food or anything. So there's your answer. Right, let's do this Best Buy complaint before some other crazy person calls in. I don't know what to get tonight though, you see, because I had, um, had Wendy's last night. So I can't get Wendy's again. Oh, and Popeyes has the best chicken. Why don't you get a Popeyes? Maybe I will. Do you want it some Popeyes? Fast. No, I don't want it. A bunch of, there was a bunch of Canadian people in this Facebook group that I'm in for, for the city. And they were all harping on about Mary Brown's chicken. Out all of them, like, Mary Brown's, Mary Brown's. It's the bit, blah, blah, blah. It was not good. I ordered Mary Brown's one night just to sample it. Not good at all. Not good at all. Just bad. Just cheap as fuck. Sorry to any Canadians that really like Mary Brown's. I also, the only ver- Oh fuck, uh oh. Hello? 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 What's up, Macron? Who this? It's a big fan, bro. It was, it, I, I just wanna say, man, uh, I've been following you for a long time. I fucking love you. Uh, Scoby is a fucking goat, and fucking Ronnie, bro, Hazel, I love all y'all cats, uh, Ooh. big time, bro, I just want to call him out of South Texas, bro. Burn on you, DS. Burn on you guys that hey. didn't get mentioned. Yeah, oh, 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 
wow. No, I love all of you. He's I love right you. here. Bro, he's, bro. he's right here, right now. Like, Hey, can I hear Ronnie? You? Can I hear Ronnie? Hey, Ronnie. Is he there, Ronnie? Are you there? He's he's at work right now. Sometimes, uh, sometimes he disappears on us. Ronnie, hold on a second. Wait, I can I can get Ronnie in here. Hold on a second. My ass. You in die. Mm. Love Tesla schlong. <laughs> Is that all right for you? Yeah. I'm gonna be yeah, a bottom. Hey, bro. Just uh, for real, for real, man. Big shout out to all of y'all. I love y'all, cat. Uh, thank you for answering my call. And yeah, uh, I've been following you, you for about two years, so to like down. I said, bro, big shout out to all of you. Uh, love y'all, guys. Everybody that's you. watching the stream, be sure to go ahead and like and subscribe to this motherfucking channel. Let's motherfucking go! Yay! That's what we like. There we go. Thanks, buddy. Woo all right, we'll see you. Take care. There he goes. There he goes. What a good call. Forgot what we were even talking about now. Mary Brown's, it was trash. Sorry. The other thing that Canadians love that I don't is uh, Swiss Chalet. You can, you can keep your Swiss Chalet. Also, special mention to where's that place that does the roast beef sandwich? Arby's. Arby's, that's, that place is good. That roast beef and cheese sandwich, that's, that's the shit. Oh, no. Uh. Hello? Hey, Ron. Hi, everybody. Hi. How you guys doing? Doing real good. How are you? Uh, all good, all good. I'm just a listener who's been listening for a very long time. I, uh, I've i been listening since the Mistress Morgan days. Oh, shit, back really? Back when you guys used to do it on Mixler. Long time. Holy shit. What's your username? What was your username on Mixler? Uh, I think it was Mr. Spade, but I haven't been on, on Mr. Uh, for a very long time since. Uh... Okay, okay, okay. Rings a bell, rings a bell. Uh, awesome, that's cool. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I visited I visited the SeaTac uh, Crest Motel, uh, you know, did a little, uh, little round there, remember? Got yeah, the yeah, call. yeah, that's right. I remember, I remember. That was you. Okay, okay. You should do it again and go check out the new owners for me. We don't we don't know much about them. Yeah, maybe I'll do that sometime. Yeah. Uh just wanted to call in and say once again I'm I'm so glad that the show's been going all these years and you know, I remember you used to talk about uh Macronathon back in like twenty fifteen or twenty sixteen. <laughs> At and least just the last yeah, few yeah. years. Yeah. Seeing one has been awesome. Awesome. All right. Well uh the next one's and gonna be happening in May, so watch out for that. Yeah, I'm really looking forward to it. My my personal favorite return on the Macronathon was Trainwreck because he's also from from the old days, and uh, those those shows were were crazy. You know, it's like I've, I've got a bit of nostalgia now. These shows have kept a lot of us going. Well, yeah, yeah. Um, it's happy. No. You know, we bought we got Trainwreck back on the first Macronathon, and we got Chumley back on the second Macronathon. So I've got to find someone else to bring back for the third one, haven't I? You need to bring uh, Jeremy back again, Ben. <laughs> Jeremy. Jeremy's always welcome. Jeremy uh, Jeremy was a good guy. Yeah, Jeremy, if you're watching, if you want to come back for the Macronathon, let me know. You know the email address. Come on, Jeremy. Jeremy, your uh, inked goddess. Yeah, just, just Jeremy... the last thing to mention, and, and I'm sorry to interrupt because I'll forget and i got to go in a second, but just still want to shout out the best prank call of all time, which was the... I think it was a murder-suicide prank call where uh, there was an airline customer and Dr. Charles was being chased by you across the, <laughs> across the building and he goes and hides in the bathroom. The Comcast the one, yeah. prank call of all time. Yeah, thank you. I agree with that. I agree with that. That's my favorite too. All right, bud. Take care. I Thanks for calling. All these years. All right, buddy. Can you, can you motherfuckers yes, thanks, call thanks in and fucking my call. Thanks, bust Ron. his fucking balls, Sorry, guys. not fucking try to suck his dick? Oh, Ronnie's here now. I'm here, yeah, I came back. Oh, he's gone anyway. Thanks for calling. <laughs> oh, no, he's there. <laughs> Thanks, everybody. Thank Talk you. you later, love you, Bo. Fuck you. He's gone. Bye, love you. All right. Uh, let's try and do this Best Buy complaint before someone else calls in. We'll be getting complaints about the lack of complaints again. That's okay. Call in and complain about it. Jeremy or Inked Goddess? I mean, they'd both be welcome back. I, that'd be cool. I don't even know how to get in touch with them at this point because they both used to use like fake Facebook accounts. So, hi, this is Tommy. 
Thank you for calling. Unfortunately, I'm. Shut up, Tony. If if uh, Ben or uh, Inked Goddess is listening, uh, call in. Hold hey, on. real quick, man, you should bring back Munch for the Macronathon. Ah, ah, fuck. The bill of upset people. Okay, we maybe maybe we'll have to have a vote on it or something. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I, I'm all for it, man. I'm gonna leave it. I, I, I've been loving the show, man. Like the the the, the uh, Karen bot. That's a really nice little take to everything. You like the Karen filter, the AI Karen filter? Yeah, that really that really threw yeah. her. She wasn't expecting that shit, right? Yeah, you're bringing a lot of uh, good fresh ideas to the show tonight, man. I like it. All right, thanks, buddy. Thanks for calling. All right, have a good one. Bye. All right, there we go. Right, fuck. Let's try and do this fucking Best Buy complaint. Come on, I want to talk to you about your Best Buy complaint. Talk to me. Hello. Hi, I'm calling from Best Buy. Am I speaking yep. with... Uh, hi, I'm calling regarding your uh, complaint. I work at the corporate complaints team. Could you tell me what happened? Uh, yeah, my, um, well, I ordered something on BestBuy.com. Okay. I went to the store, my store and picked it up. Okay. Um, I got, I'm sorry? No, carry on. Oh, okay. Penis. Uh, and then I, so I went to the store, picked it up, and, uh, got it back home and I, whatever, I was just, I just bought it. I didn't use it right away. I was, I travel for work a lot, so I was in and out of town, but. I used it a couple of times, and then the third time I went to use it, it doesn't work. And this is now it's, you know, I believe like 23 days or so have passed, 24 days have passed. Uh, so I'm like, okay, so now I'm looking. I think I'm going to have to return it. So I started looking for my receipt. I can't find the email that I got. And so I try to get on I try to get on Best Buy site and talk to the chat bot and it's giving me whatever so then i talked to i finally got somebody on there and but actually i think i called a lady and i thought she's at the store but she wasn't she works remote or whatever but she said i, well, I can't give you the receipt because whatever so she gave me an order number um and now i couldn't get anybody in the store either i mean i was, I was about to go up there because I couldn't like get anybody on the phone at the actual store. I mean, I, I was I kept getting rerouted somewhere else. So I was just trying to get a receipt so I could figure out how to return the thing. So okay, let me check day, some details. More, more, days, yeah. are going, um, more days are going by. Yeah, yeah, yeah they, they do that. that like, um, so what like, uh, what product was it that you bought? I'm sorry. I bought uh, a ninja, like a, one of those food kitchen things. Got you, got you. And what's the problem with it? Uh, I have no idea. Like the motor, just like it just it, it'll it'll just buzz and stop. Like it's like the motor's jammed. It like it won't move. Hmm. And are you near the device right now? Uh, n no. But I've I've already call, I've already called Ninja. They they already sent me a replacement. They handled it. Oh, they're sending you a replacement. Yes. Oh, so Ninja is sending you a replacement, and you want to return the faulty unit and get the cash back too? No, I do not want to return the unit. I, what are you trying, trying to do to, then? I, I don't get it. Um, well, I just told you what happened, and I told you what the problem was. I wasn't getting anywhere with anybody at Best Buy. Well, maybe that's because you're an arrogant little prick. I mean, maybe oh, try talking maybe. properly, and that wouldn't happen. So, um, oh, okay. What is it you're trying to do exactly? I'm not trying to talk to you. <laughs> he hung up. <laughs> I wonder why he's not getting anywhere talking to people like that, the fucking dipshit. Let me call him again. I don't think he likes a British accent. Somebody with American accent get in there and fucking help Hi, this is Tony. Thank you for calling. Unfortunately, I'm unavailable. They never like my accent. Nope. Especially not when they're getting roasted by it. Terrible. Fucking Brits. Hi, 
Hi, this is Tony. Thank you for calling. When I first heard it, I thought he said Tommy because he sounded kind of like Tommy Wright, just higher pitched. Wayne has been a supporter two times on YouTube, apparently. We got a little that. Uh, thanks, Wayne. Good move. Good move. Is that all the show chat ones? Did we get them all? Yeah, we did. Damn it. I was really hoping he was near the blender because I was going to get him to turn it on and fuck with it. All right. Got a UBS complaint here. Do, 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 All right, do, I'm back. What'd I miss? Oh, I miss? you missed ev Oh my god, you missed the best really? call ever. Yeah, and we didn't oh, even wait. record it. Yep. Fuck. Never what again. Never again. Deleted. Yep. We called Donald Trump and we got him to stick uh, something up his ass. Yeah. It was great. He enjoyed it. And then we called Biden and we talked him into falling over. He would. <laughs> Biden would feel it in his ass anyway. Biden would feel it in his ass anyway. No, but you could. We could play call Biden and persuade him to fall over. We don't have to ask him today. He does that every day. Yeah, but just call he him. Fell the other day. Just fell the other day again. He's always falling. Every time I see him, he's falling over. That can't be good. Like if he was your grandpa, it'd be time to go in a home, wouldn't it? If he kept falling over like that, you'd be like, come on, Grandpa, well, you need to be where people can look after you. Hey, wait, remind me when Ron takes a break, I need to talk to you. Your Who's... call has been forwarded to voicemail. Who says I'm taking a break? We're already like two hours into the show. And, uh... I said whenever you take a break, I need to talk to Scobie some sports. Oh, uh, no, well, but, you know, uh... the problem is I'm vaping on this uh, Snoop Dogg yeah, weed, no, weed vape pen. No, I don't. You'll still have to take a break. Yeah, you will. Actually, you know what? I am out of root beer. Do you want me to take a break so you can talk sports? If Scobie's in here, but... Scobie, are you here? He's quiet again. Oh, no, I can't here? take my break, can I? I'm here. All right, well, I'm going right. to take a break to get root beer. You fucking talk about sports. Fine. It's only my show. God. They're talking about in chat. That, they're talking about in chat. That's why I want to talk about Ash Scobie about. All right, whatever. You get five minutes of sports talk, okay? And then that's it. Go to Macron. Julie says five minutes and comes back at two. Macronshow.com forward slash tip if you want it to stop. Okay, goodbye. Bye. Bye. So let's go, me. Yo. What you think about this fucking idiot from UFC, Williams? Are you talking about the quarterback? Yes. Uh. Is this is this dude delusional? Well, a lot of things is with his father. It's like a kind of lamello, oh, bump the ball type shit. This is worse than the mellows. He only is going to sign with a team that actually give him a percentage of the team. That's old news, though, isn't it? They said, yeah. The leaks said that ain't happening. This weekend, he said he didn't take his physical. Yeah. At the combine. Yeah. He only wants to uh, release that shit to the team that actually interviews him. Yeah. Which is the Bears. You know what I'm saying? Honestly, I, I, honestly, I agree. I, I wish the Bears wouldn't draft him. I wish the Bears would I wonder what Matt 92 him. thinks. He, 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 don't, he don't like him. He's talking in chat right now about it. He thinks they should drive a quarterback. Actually, I think they should keep fields and get some points. That, that guy some... is a fucking complete bust if, he, if we yeah, fucking I'm telling the you. motherfucker. He's going to be a complete bust. I'm telling you, watch. I Personally, don't like, him. I don't my like his attitude. I don't like nothing about I, him. I think it's I think it's overblown. The dude is a fucking beast. He the throws he makes, no one else can do. He is literally like Patrick Mahomes like. That's my opinion. He has his nails painted, big fucking deal. His dad talks shit, big fucking deal. The guy can fucking play. There's yeah, a reason he's sometimes the labor generation fuck, the sh fuck your shit up, you know. And you see it happen with other quarterbacks, you know, supposedly big deals. You remember Let his ass slide to Mike Manning's the number two. Let that shit happen. I fucking pray. Yeah. And I like Jaden Daniels from LSU. I like his ass. But honestly, I honestly, honestly, Matt's going to get mad. Ronnie might be getting mad. I would keep Justin Fields. Yep. Trade number one for a bunch it's of not a bad idea. Picks. Trade number one for a bunch of pitch. Get Marvin Harrison Jr. in that yep. bitch. Yep. Start, start getting some fucking wide receivers. Get, uh, get you know fucking saying? better get some in the offensive, offensive get, line. Get some offensive line. They ain't no offensive line. The dude, Justin Fields is a good player. He has no, who he has? One player. 
that's that's problem and that's what they don't see they think one fucking qb is gonna fucking change everything and it can't it won't happen it doesn't work and actually give him another give him let him fucking coordinator stay there a coordinator stay there more than a year mm -hmm. they change coordinators every year of course the fucking quarterback can't fucking project progress yeah let them do whatever the fuck they want to do i hope they don't draft them kobe you heard i heard i watched the thing today about the commanders or whatever the fuck they are now right about uh what they should do they're talking about signing kirk cousins back yeah the people are just being stupid saying that so you have a chance to draft a fucking quarterback on a rookie deal for four to five years oh man I would, in kirk I, would, I would and take 40 to 50 million dollars exactly i would get i would get one of the young ones because they got a good they got a couple good ones that nobody really heard of it's just people just trying to talk to start shit. That, that that's how, it's just more click like people they you want heard, people to click on that article so they can talk shit and be like you're a fucking idiot you heard about you heard about the law the lawsuit this weekend with washington no you didn't hear about the lawsuit no the fucking indians are suing the redskins for what that shit was done with for changing their name they want the redskins back oh no See, that, <laughs> yes i love that <laughs> <laughs> They but, want the uh, Redskins back. <laughs> They're suing for real. I posted yeah, an article the other day. Too many you know. tribes that are against it than there are that 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 want it. You know. Yeah. The Indians are mad, so they changed their name. I don't know. They got some good. They got some good quarterbacks this year that nobody's really talking about. Yeah, they got the the kid from LSU, the Jane Daniels, yeah. the I, Lamar I, Jackson, maybe he, look alike. And then yeah, he's May, good, but Big Mac UNC. I like fucking uh, fuck, what's his name? Uh, shit, Who? Man. The I'm Oregon. The, I like Bo Nix. Bo Nix is good. He he needs he needs to learn more, man. He he sucked, all, he, he sucked all those years at fucking Auburn. That's why. Yeah. Michael Penix, is that who you're going to say? Yeah, Penix. I like him. That motherfucker threw that ball yesterday. You saw that? I didn't see that. I saw I saw the Tennessee him. quarterback throw that ball fucking 70 yards, but I didn't see Penix. He was Penix. slinging every pass, 60-something plus. Just barely throwing him. Boom, like, like it's nothing, 60. He's a lefty, right? Yeah, yeah, he's lefty. Yeah. I think so. I mean, there's a bunch of quarterbacks I didn't watch till like, the end. You know what I'm saying? I don't care. I, every game, every fucking weekend, you know? You gotta check the Tennessee uh, footage out. That guy had a freak show performance, like some Josh Allen type shit. Then they poor that poor offensive line they clown and they, he had the worst combine ever. They said you heard that saw that. Who? Some some I guess offensive line. I don't know who it was. It was it was a uh, he was uh they were talking about he had the worst the worst combine ever. Like he ran like a five eight five and he couldn't oh, live no. but but twelve reps and you guys had long enough yet yeah you can know. can i can i do my show now yeah i was just doing some laundry that's good we were just <laughs> we were chatting with chat we were actually chatting with chat you know something that nobody actually does sometimes no i was just doing some laundry getting comfortable over here you know yeah ron who do you think the bears should take at number one yeah no idea who the bears should want who should the Bears select with their first pick in the draft? Uh, what are my options? Caleb Williams, Jaden Daniels. You could trade back. Uh, Caleb Williams, for sure. Uh, okay. We're on the same page. Mm -hmm. He has no idea. He just said it because you said it first. I didn't hear him say it. I was literally doing laundry. I just got back. I just, you know, I know what I'm talking about. <laughs> Yeah, you can go ahead. We were just we were just chatting with chat. You know? I'm I'm quite the football expert now. You guys don't even know. Yeah, you what? Next year, this year coming up, I'm gonna get you to watch college football. I watched a bit of college football earlier this year. I was watching. It was obviously some replay or something, but I was watching it. We'll get you to watch Who? college football on Saturdays. Hold on, you gotta let me respond to this guy in chat. Who book? You really think Fields? You take Fields on your team tomorrow over golf? Yeah, golf can't scramble for shit, but he. Quarterback, playing the position of quarterback. You guys had the best season you've ever had in fucking my lifetime. You talking about you would trade, you would get rid of golf for fields? And I, hey, I appreciate you, brother. You're a fan. I get it. 
but I, I'm just saying that's that's difficult. Uh, that's tough. Go to room you two. I was wondering why the phone wasn't ringing, and it's because I closed the dialer when I left, so oh. it wouldn't ring. Yeah, people weren't calling in while we were talking. So. Nope, nope. We don't want that shit. All right, here we go. You can call in again now, by the way, if you want to. I can just turn oh, that look, shit the off. Oh, singer. We called him the other day. Who? Uh, Belfast put a complaint in here. We called him the other day. He didn't answer it or something. Oh, yeah, I remember this dude. Who? What? Where? When? Remember that why? name? In chat. Which one? The Roger Griner, Griner, Greener, the Roger one. Roderick. Six, yeah, we call him the other day. I remember that name. Hold that on, that guy with the shittiest pair of fucking Nikes that money can buy. That's the pandas, right? You see that shit? Pandas, everybody got That's pandas, the fucking bro. pandas. No one, only a fucking dipshit would buy the pandas. Like, I'm sorry, I'm not like. I, I'm not even a big sneaker head. I'm not even a big sneaker snob, right, or anything. Like, I like, I just like Jordans. I like basically all Jordans, but everyone knows not to buy the pandas. Yeah, yeah. Everyone yeah, knows this dude, not this to dude buy the pandas. Out. This dude cursed us out. I remember. He did? It's the black dude. The black dude curses out, yes. Let me see who else he can Fuck it. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to call him next, then. I'm going to try to see what, uh, no, you call the other guy. I'm going to see who he called, he, who he complained about the other day. This dude posted a picture of his feet like some kind of flex. He's wearing grey fucking old man socks and a beat up pair of fucking Nike pandas, which is just makes him a dick. Like um, he so I think he sounded like a girl when he answered. That guy, yeah, we called yeah. him the other day. What was he complaining about? Complaining about Delta, uh, Hertz. I think it was Hertz he was complaining about. Oh, was it? Then yeah, I'm looking he was right now. Up. Can I roast his sneakers? Can I just call him roast his sneakers? Yeah, go ahead. He, anyway. he used to hang up on you. Hung up on us last time. We'll see about that. I'm trying to see. It had to be like a week or two ago. If he's probably just gonna hang up, then I'm just gonna talk shit to him. I think it was. I think it was last Monday show. Yeah. Your call has been forwarded to voicemail. If any of you listening have a pair of the pandas, toss them out. Can't wear those without looking stupid. Your call has been forwarded to voicemail. The person you're trying to reach. Uh oh. Corporate office. Okay. Mm, mm, mm. All right. Who am I going to call next? Uh, let's see. Let's do this. Let's do this lift one. I feel like we haven't done a lift one for ages. Yeah, they're just complaining to the news and stuff about lift. <laughs> complaining to the <laughs> news. Oh, yeah, the tag CBS Philadelphia, NBC Philadelphia, ABC. I wonder how many times a day the news stations get tagged get by tagged. Karens, like, you know. Hello, huh? That's, that's a database of numbers I would like access to. Hello? Yo, Macron, what's up? It's B-Dog. Hey, B-Dog. What happened? No, nah, dude, I just, hey, thanks for taking the calls, and I just want to give you guys a shout out. This, this show is, like, honestly the best thing ever. Uh, you have, like, an awesome team. I love Hazel, Ronnie, you know, DS. Let's go. I could just keep on. Finally, people, someone but, uh, said DS. DS, how happy are you right now? Tell us. I, I'm going to unserve a mute DB dog right now. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yes. You just made a new friend. No. You just made a, a new friend. B dog. He's a good perfect, boy. Perfect, perfect. B dog. But B -dog's yeah, you know, people. I've been listening for years, and, and honestly, dude, like, you've gotten a lot of us. I mean, especially for me, but, you know, for a lot of people that listen to the show, like, You've gotten us out of some dark times, and just the the comedy that you bring is just like amazing, and never stop, never stop. That's, That's what we do. Say. I'll try not to. That's the plan. I will try not to. Okay. Awesome. All well, right, buddy. For call. All right. No, thank you for calling. Love you, B dog. Take care, B dog. We love you. Okay. Take care. Bye. Bye. That was B dog, everyone. B 
B dogs. Oh my god. Oh my god, Ryan. B dogs are good people. The dude, we just called the third singer, lead singer. I just went to. I was on his Twitter and I went to his likes. Uh. -uh. Do you want to see the first picture? Oh no. Is it like pawn? It's pawn, isn't it? Uh, it's no. gonna be pawn. Close, close to it. Okay. Oh, Good. there we go. Yep, yep. That was yep. the first picture. Yep. Okay. Okay. <laughs> we all know what's going on there. Hello. Hey, Mr. Run. Oh, oh shit. fucking hell. Here we Fuck. go. Oh. Yeah. What's up, King Coco? What's up? What's uh, up? If this is about it's King Vaughn, King Vaughn, I'm Vaughn? gonna get fucking pissed. Shut up, Karma. <laughs> I'm gonna get real pissed if you start about that again. Jesus, TS, you don't even know. Um, well, what? it's <laughs> funny because I have uh, I have loads of time on my hands because I actually <laughs> walked up to the gas station and uh, you know to buy some stuff and I was like, fuck, I really gotta take a leak. And I was like, hey, let me get the bathroom key. Um, you know, so the guy hands me like a half a tire and like a spatula thing and there's like a key hooked to it. It's really, it's pretty great actually. And, uh, so I go in the bathroom and like, now I'm like, I can't get out. Now I'm like locked in the bathroom. So like, I was like, well, you know what? Like the first thing I thought of was like, well, I might as well just jerk off. And so like, I was just. I was like, okay, cool. And then, like, I couldn't bring up my internet browser. And, and so I just, I went, I have, like, one photo on my phone, and it's, like, of DS. So I, I just was, like, I just, I started fucking jerking it. And, like, I ended up coming all over his face. Nice. It was great. And then, uh, <laughs> fucking, now my nice. phone is fucked up. And I'm still locked in the bathroom. Oh, That's a good fun. story. Oh well, thanks for calling yeah. in, anonymous listener. Yeah. Can you can you make sure. a glory hole for us, bro? Were you in there? Uh, yeah, I probably can. I can. I can probably do it. Yeah. Can you jerk can you it? A, can you, you jerk you it right now a... while we listen? <laughs> yeah, can you, like, jerk I was, it, yeah, jerk I mean, it a little I'm bit actually, for us. No. Just jerk it I'm a little bit for us, and then you can say you jerked it on the Macron show. Just jerk it a little bit for us. Forever. Yeah, just you can say you jerked it on the Macron show on YouTube in front of, uh, let's see how many people are watching right now. Uh, there's 128 sure. people here right now, so if you want to jerk it in front of yeah. over 100 people right now, that would be perfect. Actually, would you mind doing it next week for me and Scobie's birthdays? Because I'd really like to hear you jerk it. Okay. okay. That'd be great. Okay. Can you all nasty motherfuckers just shut the fuck up? <laughs> Can you hear that? Can you hear that? Oh, oh yes. Dude. There he's doing it. Oh, oh yes. Oh, oh, fuck. Push it. Ah. Oh. You like that? Yeah. That's that. Nice. <laughs> Perfect. Thanks, buddy. All right. I love all right, you, brother. Coco. I've got to go now because I'm all at right. work, okay? Sure, sure. Love all you right. guys. Love you too. Bye. There he goes. Someone in chat just asked me if I checked on my crypto lately, and normally I wouldn't respond to that, but I'm like, you know what, I'm going to log in and have yeah, a look. Yeah, it's, it's, it's like 38,000. Fuck's going on. My, my portfolio is up 71.5% right now. Um, my portfolio being fucking tiny. Let me tell you how much Bitcoin I've actually got. You guys should fix it. You guys who do crypto, I do accept crypto as a donation. You know, you can really help out the show. Do you want to know how much Bitcoin I've got, DS? This is going to blow your mind. Are you ready? Point one. I have 72 pounds worth of Bitcoin. <laughs> 72 pounds. So you have pounds. like a point zero 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 one. I have 0.001302 Bitcoins. Okay, because like one Bitcoin right now is like 38k, I think. Yeah, no, I have 0 0.001 Bitcoins. It's about, to, it's about to be the highest it's ever been. This week, they said. Um, I do. To... Oh, actually, would, would you look at that? I actually have... Do you know how many Shiba Inu coins I have? I have no fucking idea what you're talking about. Shiba, yeah, okay. Shiba Inu is the little dog. You know the little Shiba dog, the dog, the internet oh, meme yeah, yeah, thing. Oh, yeah, 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 the little coin. The coin okay, coin so he has his own coin, right? And about two years ago, my buddy who does crypto was like, you might as well buy like two million coins, right? Because it's like yeah. two million coins back then cost me like six bucks. Like, no joke. Yeah, so how many Like you six, have seven bucks. Uh, so I have two million coins. It's now worth 65 pounds. There you go. 
So that's like, I actually, you know. Too bad too bad we couldn't go back and buy Bitcoin when it was like, you know, two pennies. Too bad I didn't put 100k in there, and if I withdrew it right now, I'd be laughing, but there you go. But, um, fuck, everything's way up, way up. Um, yeah, everything way up, yeah. Holy shit, yeah, Bitcoin's up 7% right now. Yeah, it's like 38k yesterday when they were talking about it. Yeah, I have a tiny amount of Bitcoin. Oh, uh, stop it. with the Bitcoin. You guys, you yeah. guys who do crypto, please go to macronshow.com forward slash donate, not tip, macronshow.com forward slash donate. And if you scroll oh. to the bottom, there's a bunch of crypto addresses. And if you want to be really cool and send over some Bitcoin, let me know and I'll give you a big we'll special shout out. All we need is one. If anyone has a different form of crypto that I don't have and wants to send it to me, let me know and I'll get the wallet or whatever I have to do. Go ahead. Yo, what's up? Going what's up? up? What up? Who this is? That's Ryan. What's happening, G? Who this is? Is that Tommy Wright? You know who this is. It's yeah, Tommy I know who Wright. this is. I know, always this know who this is. My boy, my boy, Tommy Wright. Tommy Wright. Uh, yes, what's happening, man? What what's up, happening? my boy? I'm on the trail trying to find Jeff so I can do something to him in Minecraft. You know where it is. Oh, yeah. You know, we just out here cutting, slinging, swinging. You know all that shit. Yeah, yeah. Stroking hey, it. Scobie, you on the line, bro? Yeah, Scobie's here. Scobie, call for you. Scobie line one. Scobie. Hey, man, Caleb Williams is a fucking idiot, bro. <laughs> yeah, that yeah. yeah. is going to be a damn bust in the NFL. Yes. This dude is fucking big mouth trash. And Who? fuck Justin Fields, send his ass to Atlanta. We need him. <laughs> Who? Caleb Williams. Justin Fields, oh, we man. need him. But Taylor Williams is a fucking idiot, bro. He's going to be a bust, guaranteed. Can you tell me specifically what it is, though? Let's have a discussion. Huh? Let's have a let's have a discussion though. What exactly about it would you pass on him? Why? Dude, he's gonna be a big. He's gonna be like Antonio Brown, man, just going around the league, causing trouble instead of focusing on the game, playing football. And granted, he's good, but he's gonna be too much of a distraction, man. Okay, you put him so... on a team like the Chicago Bears or somebody that's struggling, man, he's gonna be a nightmare. So, what would you suggest they do? do you, okay, so my bad. I, I missed the beginning. Do you think they should just keep Fields and then trade the number one pick? Who, the Bears? Yeah. Hell no, nah, man. I'm, bro, I'm in a lot of We need Fields. That's so, that's I'm your saying. squad? You yeah, the Chicago, Bears, the Chicago Bears do not need Justin Fields. Send them to us. We'll take care of them. Tommy, you Tommy know, is a yeah. Atlanta fan. You know what, Tommy? It doesn't matter because the Saints are still going to whip your ass next year, boy. <laughs> Damn. You know what, DS man? Fuck you and them damn Saints. <laughs> Those dirty birds can't fucking hang. <laughs> man, I ain't going to take up much of y'all time, man. I just wanted to call and check in and talk about your damn shit. And Jeff, if I find you, bro, man, you're going to have problems in Minecraft. Jeff, you know where it is. Minecraft. It's we know what good. it is in Minecraft. Time. Minecraft. In Minecraft. Minecraft. It's so, Minecraft. Safe it's travel, good. man. Safe travel. All right. All take good, care, Tommy. Tommy. Hey, quickly, you. Tommy. All right. Tommy, I might be rolling through yeah. Georgia. This is Dale. Uh, we're going to go out to dinner if I come through right. there, brother. Yeah, man. Yeah, hit me up. Yeah, hit me up. Bye, Alex. Yay. All right. Safe All travels. Right. Peace out. Bye. Tommy Wright, that's my boy. That's my security guard. Uh, when I go out, when, uh, Tommy Wright. When I go to the United States, that's mine and Hazel's security guard right there. Huh. The hell is this? Well, you know what they say about black people. Well, I admit I'm the first black person with a small dick, only two inches, and that's when it is erect. What the fuck, Scobie? Scobie. <laughs> Wait, was that lime on the air? Scobie. Yeah. Scobie. Scobie, really? Fuck? Why did you say that? You said it was muted. Oh my god. <laughs> really, buddy? Like, that's kind of private information. You should keep that to yourself, though. Let Jesus. alone on a Monday show. I was not you expecting that. How many people, people's dreams you broke admitting that? Yeah. Wow.
Well, sorry about that broke, news, you everyone. Broke Hazel's heart. On that bombshell, let's try and call this complainer. You just got removed from like 25 spank banks. Oh. Hello? Hello. This is Ronathan calling from Lyft. How are you doing? Hi, how are you? I'm real good, thank you. Reason for the call is that I saw you'd reached out to our social media team with a complaint and uh, I just wanted to find out what happened. So, I filed a dispute with my bank today because I was so, I was livid on Saturday. I'm sorry, sir. Tell me your name again. Please excuse me. I have oh, brain for some time. No problem. My name is Ronathan. How do you spell that? Like Jonathan? With like an R? That's correct, yes. Yeah, like it's a European name. Okay, thank you. Um, so Saturday, I, and you could, if you are able to see my profile in the app, I've been using Lip for a while. Like I believe, I thought I had like a five profile, but it, it kind of went down a notch. I'm like, I don't even know if this incident um, brought me down or what have you, but I, I'm, you know, I don't cause any trouble. I tip the drivers or, you know, if, if I don't tip, I'm putting the reasons, the rationales in. So I'm coming from a funeral. It was very stormy here on Saturday in Philadelphia. I I'm so sorry to place. hear that. Whose funeral was it? Um, this was one of, it was a close friend. It was her father. So okay, got you. Okay. Father, but I was got there, you, you know, got in you, got one. You. Sure, um, sure. Well, I'm I'm sorry you know, to hear that. That's always a shame. Yes. Um, so I'm sorry. Continue. I, um, want, wanted to just run a quick quick errand and head home. I entered Shoprite of Roosevelt Boulevard, which I've taken lift to before. When when it came up, it showed you eleven thousand. Roosevelt Boulevard. There's only one shop right on the boulevard. Entered it. Gentleman came. He picked me up, and he pulls into this closed right aid that's across the street from an Acme. And he says, "Okay, well, this is your destination point." And I said, "No, it's not." And I could see the top of his phone said "Shop Right of Roosevelt Boulevard." And so I said, "Well, here." I said, "Here's." I pulled up the app on my phone. I showed him my phone. And I said, Here, sir, this is where you're supposed to drop me off. And he said, well, this is the destination. You know, this is how it's coming up on the map. I can't take you any further. They're not going to pay me. I'm like, but I'm not at my destination. It's over 20 blocks away and it's rainy outside. So he said, well, I'm not going to take you there. I said, okay, so can you at least just drive me across the street to the Acme? But this is not my destination. So he drives me over and I said, okay, well, I'm reporting this to Lyft. I'm not going to pay for this ride because I literally am over 20 blocks away. But where he left me, it was 8200 Roosevelt Boulevard, not 11,000 Roosevelt Boulevard. And he refused to go any further. And then he told me that if I didn't get out of his car, he was calling the cops, which, number one, is very, uh, uh, you know, uh, here in oh my the States, goodness. you know how our people are divided. That's a very racially charged statement right there. Like, and I'm like, are you serious? Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, what? Fine. Just let me, just so I can make sure I've got this on the record. Um, what was the racially yeah. charged statement exactly? Say it again. What? He said that he was going to call the cop on me. I wasn't. And that's racist. Was cursing at this man. Wait. So hold on. So, so him, him, him saying he was going to call the cops because of your behavior is racist. Him saying that he was going to call the cops on me when nobody was doing anything to But how, I, I just have to ask, madam, and I'm so, I'm so sorry, I just have to make sure that my report to my superiors is accurate, so I apologize for questioning you, but could you just explain to me how exactly that's racist? What I'm saying is, is I said we're in a racially charged environment, and to say that to a black person that isn't doing anything to you is a very racially charged statement. You don't. You but it would be. But are you, and are you saying? But it would be okay to say that to a white person. I didn't say that, sir. I so said why are you saying exactly? Why are you saying exactly then? I'm just trying to understand for my report. That's all. If you could explain. It's, you, it's racist to say that you will oh call God, the cops on a black person because they're black. You, 
Isn't that racist in and of itself? I mean, you're saying that just be... You, I mean, okay, I'm just trying to understand it. Just to, explain to me again you're what you're quite, saying. Why are you talking over me? Explain to me again, please. I did explain it. What I said is, is that's a very racially charged statement. To say that you're going to call the cops on somebody that isn't doing anything to you, I literally is racist, said to you that racially you can call the cops on anybody, but in this environment... In today's environment, in 2024, okay. to say that you're calling a cop on a black person that hasn't done anything to you is even more insulting. Interesting. Okay. Okay. I'm just listening to you, so I'm just putting that in my report, that's all. Um, so I just need for my report some information about the driver. Could you tell me a description of the driver, please? His name is Mohammed. He's in the app. Okay. And you don't count Muhammad as being a, a person of color? I didn't say that. Well, you but said that. He's not African American. Oh, so specifically, matter, specifically, you're not allowed to the, call the cops on an African American no matter what they do because that's well, racist. You but fixated on that part of the conversation. It was just a very interesting point that you brought up. That's all. Um, it, I mean, you, okay, I well, haven't. Move past it because I've already explained it. Yeah, it's just kind of what 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 what, what you said is very racist. That's all. I hope you understand that. Oh, she hung up. She didn't like that at all. Am I? What the fuck? <laughs> she got to a bitch with I'm a not making. Car, call cops. I'm not making any statement here, but like, can we? Can I get an opinion on this? Or like, when she said when she said his name was Muhammad, I actually slapped my forehead with my hand. So she was obviously like, yelling at the driver and stuff, right? Which is fair yeah, enough because it sounds. Get out my car. It sounds get like he car, fucked call up. The cops. So he said, "Get out, or I'll call the cops." And that's, yeah, race, that's, racist. that's racist because she's African-American. And she even specified yeah. it. Not a person of it's color or a brown or black person, but specifically because her Hello. ancestry is from Africa, it's racist to threaten to call the cops and on her. And then she said his name was Mohammed. It what is 2024, Ron. Is, uh, can anyone give me their opinion on that? Hello. Uh -huh. Do you have an opinion on this? I've got an order for six large pizzas. Okay. Are you going to pick them up? Uh, yes. Um, they've been uh, ready for um, uh, 45 minutes on the, the, the shelf. Okay. I will be down there to collect them in 17 years. 17 years. So, so now this is a wasteful of uh, six pizzas? No. I will be there to collect them on the 4th of March in 17 years. Well, um, there was a um, order placed no. with this number, and um, here at yes. the Pizza Hut. Yes, I know. It's that's my pizzas. I want the six pizzas, but I want them that's to be. That's bullshit. Start playing fucking games. No fucking yeah. pizzas gonna make fucking right. six pizzas without prepayment. You fucking con. Hang up the phone before I fucking trace your fucking shit. Back it was for pickup. In, in Man, suck a fucking dick. Pick, pick up. I'm gonna fucking pick up your damn fucking ass. Shut the fuck up. You're fucking trying to be French, motherfucker. Um, so, somebody man, 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 man. shut the fuck emeralds. up! Do they need yeah. preparation H? Your fucking mom's gonna pay for him. She's gonna pay with her fucking ass. <laughs> my, my mother's in an urn. <laughs> Your mother is what? My mother's in an urn. Well, Have then it'll just be easier to get his dick in there, won't it? Now, what exactly. else do you want? Use it as a regular. Grandma, let me stop in the living room. <laughs> <laughs> fuck you and fuck your mother. Yeah, get out of here. Sprinkle <laughs> a little bit on the pizza. Fucking morons. I'm sorry. Wow, that was dark. I'm fucking sorry, everyone. We've got dicks going into urns now. Um, I don't know. I want a genuine opinion on that. Isn't it a bit fucking racist to say that people aren't allowed to call the cops on you because you're African-American? Well, to be fair, what is the driver kicking her out for? What the hell? If he had the wrong GPS... That was my question, too. He did fuck what up. I don't get. Oh, the driver's a stupid bancho that fucked up. Don't get me wrong. I'm not no, on but, his no, side. No, but like, why would he be threatening to call the cops? She must have done something. She was just yelling at him. She was just yelling at him. Get out of my car. He doesn't have anywhere to be. What happened? 
Yeah. Maybe she was just talking loud. She she yeah. got fucking ghetto with him. She got ghetto with him. And he said, bitch, get out of my fucking car. I'm calling the cops. It's plain and simple. Even though, all right, but work on the assumption that she didn't even do anything wrong in inverted commas. And she was the one that brought up right and wrong. But, like, she said she didn't do anything wrong, right? She got the cops call on her. But is it correct that it's racist to threaten to call the cops on a black person for doing nothing wrong? But it's not racist at all if it's a white person or a brown person or whatever a person you know whoever that's why i'm kind of questioning here how does the logic work like because she it's said it's it's 2020 well or is it nothing to do with race or just to do with their behavior or perceived behavior exactly no, they do with race. so i, I no, you're right that's you're my right. question right like um I'm taking this i can you know uh, like if i was an asshole in the back of a taxi and someone threatened to call the cops are you saying is it racist or is it not racist if it's me because I'm a white guy? But then if it's a black yeah, if woman, you're being a dick. is that where's the line? I'm asking where the fucking barometer is. Like, is there a line that says like racist, not racist? And then like, OK, so she's a black woman, so it is racist. But like, it doesn't matter if it was an Asian woman we we or whatever. It just doesn't make sense. Her entire logic doesn't make sense to me. Like I, it's not like it's the first time we heard something like that before, you know? It's quite well, correct. Yeah, so if, if she did nothing wrong, and let's assume that she didn't do anything wrong, let's not make assumptions about how she behaved in the taxi. Maybe she was sweet and kind and the driver was a fucking asshole, right? Which okay, happens. Can we fuck that stupid bitch in right? a fucking No, 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 no. Listen, right. Move on. I would just be more outraged that I had the cops called on me when I didn't do anything wrong. How does race have to come into it? Why does that apply? I don't think it's a racial issue. Because that's excuse for a black person Everything i would do, but i would just against them i would just be pissed are, that i didn't do anything racist. wrong and someone called the cops and your race should be irrelevant and the guy was oh. a fucking called muhammad as well so like anyway fuck her fuck her off anyone want to talk scoby you want to talk to her you want to be a supervisor she's probably ready for a fight again now you yeah can... let me close my window this guy's racing his fucking atv or the fuck by my house thing nice you hear that Nope. Ask her why the driver was trying to kick her out. Fucking dick it. I hate this kid. Why is yeah, and especially the driver. I was like, I always hear uh, that, oh, the driver said I couldn't go. They had somewhere else to be. Nuh uh. You get beeped after you drop the person off. So he had nowhere to be. Yeah, he just wanted her out the fucking car for some reason. Which, you know, who knows what that reason really yeah, was. Yeah, and then why bother picking the person up if you're going to kick him out? Well, one of them was being an could, asshole. Could, we know could, that. We know that through the process him, of elimination. Because either him or her put the wrong address in. And he's at that address and she won't get out. Mm. So. Okay, then be a nice person and take her to where she's supposed to go. Couldn't, like, he, just, the couldn't he have just charged her for the rest of the journey too? Yeah. Like, why would yeah, he want? The, why wouldn't he want the money? She could have edited maybe, the destination yeah, to the correct destination. Maybe he didn't yeah. like her. Maybe he just didn't like her. Maybe she stunk. Yeah, I mean, who fucking knows what she did? All right, let's call it a bitch. So is this Lyft? Yeah, so we'll yeah. Lyft, and uh, yeah, just... Um, What's her name? Uh, Hold on, which one is it? Da, da, da. It was Lyft, wasn't it? I'm getting the right complaint here. Da, 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 da. Yeah, it's Lyft. Just go up, I think. I'm getting all mixed up with them now. Was it in the numbers server? Or was it in here? No, it's in the main chat. In here. It's in the main chat somewhere. I don't even know where we got it from. <laughs> uh, here he is, right here. Sort of somewhere. There's a bunch of you pictures of uh, that guy's Twitter yeah. likes. Uh, what is it? We did the... to... Yeah, that's what I'm looking for. Was that her, Tom Thomasina? Tom the guy. Yes, does the one. Thomas. Thomasina. Is that a girl? Where is that? I can't see it. All right, anyway, yeah. Scobie. Um, yeah, this is it. Here, Scoby, here's a complaint. It's about Lyft, yeah, anyway. Fuck her up, Scoby. That's her name? Thomasina. Okay. <laughs> yes. I, yeah, okay. Yes. Hey, nigga, my name is Scoby. I'm calling from Lyft. I'm calling about a complaint. My supervisor had asked that I go ahead and give you a call. I'm actually up above him. Apparently, there was a dispute. There was a dispute but the last person just called me has royally pissed me the fuck off and i'm really tired of lyft i have been using your agency for years years and i have never been treated with such disrespect okay can if you don't mind me asking in all the calls are recorded 
can we kind of start at the beginning, ma'am? Is that okay? Sure. But someone needs to listen to Ronathan's call, the last person that called What me. was his name? I'm because sorry? Ron, he said his name was Ronathan. Ronathan. And I asked him, is that like Jonathan with an R? And he said, yes, this is a European name. Okay, nigga. Okay, I got you. Okay, what happened? With on Saturday or with Ronathan? With with the Ronathan gentleman. We can start we can start wherever so you'd he, like, ma'am. Okay, I'm sorry. Tell me your name, please. My name is Scobie. That's S C is in cat O B Y. Scobie. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. So Scobie, I was telling Jonathan what happened, which was <laughs> I called a list. I've been a list member for I don't know how long and I, I, I'm, I'm sorry I'm just, <laughs> he would have been better off just leaving me alone like why he's calling me after 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time and pissing me off I have no idea I literally had calmed down from Saturday I left a funeral on Saturday and called a lift to run an errand real, real quick and then I was going to lift home the driver I put in shop right of right Roosevelt Boulevard and the address comes up, 11,000 Roosevelt Boulevard. That is the correct address. This gentleman stopped at an abandoned Rite Aid across the street from an Acme. An Acme is at 8200 Roosevelt Boulevard. So he said, oh, that Acme used to be a shop right. And I'm like, I've lived in this section of the city for over 10 years. It's never been a shop right. And he says, well, this is the end destination. And I said, well, no. ShopRite of Roosevelt Boulevard is at 11,000. It had the correct address when I entered to, to you know, be dropped off at the destination. Nigga, can we stop there just for well, one second? I just want to make sure that we're on the same page. So you provided an address to him. He applied the address into his system. You all arrived at destination, and, and I'm just confused. When you put the at when you say where you want to go in the app, right, it shows you the address. So ShopRite of Roosevelt Boulevard came up in the search bar, and it shows you that it's at 11,000 Roosevelt Boulevard. I'm letting you know that that's what I selected. If you go into my account, you see that it says ShopRite of Roosevelt Boulevard. So when he attempted to drop me off, in the 8200 block of Roosevelt Boulevard, I was telling him that this isn't the address. It's not even the correct store. Are you following me? Yes. Okay. Is that it? Is You said you didn't understand, so I'm just making sure you have clarity. You tell me. Well, it just sounds like that the, the, essentially there was a disagreement that, again, he plugged in an address that was provided to him. And in his screen, it, it said that, you know, he had arrived at the destination, but you were, there was a disagreement between you two. I didn't even get to the, the disagreement. You just said you didn't understand. I'm not sure what you weren't following. So I want to make sure you are following me so I can continue. Well, I'm, that's, that's what I'm saying now. I'm asking you to continue. Okay, so I, where I left off is I'm, he's sitting in across the street from the Acme. We're not even in the parking lot of the Acme. We are in a closed Rite Aid is where he turned in at. And he said, let me see your phone. And I showed him my phone that it said the same thing that his phone said, ShopRite of Roosevelt Boulevard. I could see it on, on the screen that he was following, but he said the destination was across the street at the Acme. And I'm like, sir, it's raining. The shop right is over 20 blocks away. This isn't my destination. And he said that he could not drop me off there because he would not get paid. And I said, okay, but it's raining. And this isn't the stop that I put in. And he said, well, I don't know what to tell you. I'm not going to get paid. I'm like, all right, fine. Can you just at least drive me into the Acme parking lot? So there's an so, issue of rain being applied to your wig, and that's what I this whole disagreement is from? In the app. I put the wrong address in oh. the app. I'm sorry. There's somebody else talking. 
in the computer. Somebody else is talking. I can hear that. Like, I that was only me. ordered I, I asked... a lift as I killed my friend. I am the reason there was a funeral. I had to get out of there quickly. That's why I ordered a lift. Oh, so it wasn't I, an issue no, of rain I being hit to your fucking wig. There was no issue of that. I admit, Ronathan. I sir, am I'm sorry. There are there are two different conversations. I didn't say I put the wrong address in the app. I put the wrong address in the app. Ma'am, all I hear is you. Fuck off. I put the wrong address in the app. Fuck off. Oh my god, this line else, is perfect. I can hear another one. I can hear another I'm one. Sorry. Thing and, and... I'm sorry. I'm Hello? in a busy I'm in a busy call center, so I do apologize, but I, I hear you perfectly fine, sweetheart. I'm sorry. No, I'm sorry. Um every time I go to speak, I'm literally I was hearing somebody else's conversation and they were like yelling and cursing at somebody. Okay. I'll try to get so, I'll, I'll try to let me see if I can um Try to turn this down, okay. just line down a little bit. I'm sorry, but continue on. Oh, no fuck problem. off, no problem. Okay. Oh my gosh, she keeps telling somebody to f off. You can you hear her? Can you hear that? I put the wrong address in the app. Fuck off. You put the wrong address in the mm-hmm. app. I didn't say that. That's what the other woman is saying. <laughs> That's fuck not off. me. You hear it? That's not me. So continue on, ma'am. You were saying something about okay. rain. You were worried that it was getting on your wig, and you were you were concerned. Say it again. You, you were saying what? something about the rain. Yes, it was. It was extremely rainy. So when I'm, you know, getting my, gathering my stuff to get out, and I'm like, okay, so I'm going to report this. I'm not paying for this ride, you know. And he's like, well, I can't take you any further because they're not going to pay me, and you need to get out of my car. You know, I'm going to call the cops. And I'm like, okay, so again, I'm not going to pay for this ride, and you calling the cops when I haven't done anything to you is 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 crazy. Fuck off. Like, so he was extremely. I'm sorry, sir. If you hear that other person saying F off, that's not me. Can you hear that? F off, that's not me. Scoby? Fuck off. That's not me. Scoby? Fuck off. That's not me. What? Ma'am, I'm here. No, somebody is like manipulating my voice. My name Are is Thomas Enum and, and I am a racist. That's not me. You're my name is Thomas Enum and I am a racist. Why are you Fuck calling off. yourself a racist right now, ma'am? She hung <laughs> into the ask me parking. <laughs> my name Poor is Thomas Enum and I am a racist. Fuck off. <laughs> Fuck off. Fuck off. Drive me into the ass me parking lot. That's not me. That's not me. Drive me into the ass me parking lot. That's not me. Fuck off. That's not me. That's, not me. That's, That's not me. Okay. <laughs> She was getting fucking uncomfortable. Somebody's manipulating my voice. <laughs> I put the wrong address in the app. Like, I only ordered me. a lift as I killed my friend. I am the reason there was a funeral. I had to get out of there quickly. That's why I ordered a lift. You gotta love AI. <laughs> Look what technology has brought us. Like, we all thought we'd have flying cars and hoverboards and fucking self and sneakers by now. Nope. We can just make voices say. Fuck off. It's perfect. That's not me. <laughs> That's not me. <laughs> Fuck off. That's not <laughs> me. <laughs> <laughs> We better call her back, make sure she's okay. <laughs> Come on, man. Rewa in. Scopy, what the fuck? Rewa in. Let me be. Please Muhammad. leave your message for. Thomasina. What? Rewa the bitch and let me be Mohammed. Let me be just, Mohammed. Let me just change my number by one digit. Yeah, I was going to have Ronnie be Mohammed. Ronnie, just call and say this is Mohammed. Your lift drug. <laughs> oh, she's, okay. she's just fucking hanging up now. Oh, just scared. We're she sorry, doesn't... the number you have dialed is unavailable what? from your calling area. <laughs> Did she fucking turn that off? <laughs> oh, she doesn't. She, no, she doesn't like the fake number I used. Let me fix that. Call from her own number. I can actually do that in a second. Yeah, <laughs> hold on.
please leave your mess. Looks like she's wow. turned her phone off. Shit done. Oh no. Okay. Okay. Well, move on. Speaking of people with their phones turned off. No, we, we never even called him today. We never even checked in with the old man. Well, okay, I'm gonna answer him. Oh, we forgot all about his ass. Poor Jeff. Jeff. My name is Thomasina. I have got an itchy camel toe. Oh shit, fucking lock resurfaced again. Lock came back, yeah, we were playing games last night. You missed oh, it. Uh, you yeah, missed some shit. Oh shit. Yeah. He went to the Ram Ranch for a week. He did. Oh. Uh, cat's out of the bag. How is your asshole? Uh, it's hard to sit. <laughs> you have reached. After leaving a message, you can hang Jeff. up or press. Jeff. Hello? Mmm, talk to me all seductive, Ronnie. Ah, oh, shit, what are you wearing? Mmm. Mmm. Oh, yeah. Tell me. Lick I it. I want to talk to Ronnie. Ronnie, tell him to lick it. Yeah, talk to me, baby. What do you got to say? Mm, tell me about your butthole. Oh, yeah. Gigino <laughs> Trattoria. <laughs> You scared them away. Why the fuck would you play that? <laughs> huh? <laughs> he, uh, he hung up. He did. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> maybe Why that would you scare him away? That was enough to game off. Maybe maybe that was his real name and he Tell shit. His, he was like. Your butthole. Gigino <laughs> 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 Trattoria. Oh my god. My ass. <laughs> Lick it. Mmm. Loft my ass. Mmm. You have a nice body. Lick it for me. Fucking pair of boobs, huh? You know, you're gonna be a bottom. Mmm. Hello, 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 hello. Oh, spit in my mouth. Throw it up. Hello. 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 I'm gonna come over there. I'm gonna slap you in the fucking Mahmoud Lokman. Hello. 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 I don't, even to, I don't even have to talk anymore. <laughs> you and I. You and I. Oh my god. Yeah. My name is Thomasina and I am a racist. <laughs> Hello. You were looking at my ass and you were licking your lips. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me about your butthole. <laughs> it's waiting for you. <laughs> oh my god. All right, goodbye. Okay. <laughs> Where the fuck all this shit comes from? Fucking luck, I don't know what's going on. Uh, all right, was she the last one in the show? No, no, there's... Okay, so we already did the Hertz guy that won't pick up. Let's do this budget one before we get out of here. Yeah, the guy with the budget, they sent him a bill for 125 bucks for excessive dirt. <laughs> it's not our fault you fucking st stained the fucking seats in the back, motherfucker. Someone said one more complainer, please. Okay, just for you, Joho, one more complainer. Then I'll get the fuck out of here. Please leave your message for... That person's name is Boop. <clears throat> like the other fucking numbers. Please leave. Should I call them and be like, "Hi, am I speaking with?" Boop. <laughs> oh. That's one of Elon Musk's kids. One of Elon Musk's kids is just called Boop. 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 How you spell that? Dale says I should call uh, the show Ronnie's Butthole. Fuck no. <laughs> What should I call the show? Funniest, the person who types the funniest show name into the chat right now, I will name the show after their suggestion. Okay, go. Now, it says, uh, you call I. Ronnie's Butthole. Call no. Ronnie's Butthole. Oh. Yes. I don't know if iTunes will like that so much. Yeah, they, they, they won't like a butthole. This person doesn't work at all. Let's check in with the fat people. Oh, actually, no, let's... We got some more in here that we didn't do at all. Let's see. No, no, has a we oh, no, we could. No, we got all these, right? We got all these. We got them all. We got all the complainers. That's it. No more complainers. 
You were looking at my ass and you were licking your lips. Yep. Unless there's any really, oh, really fresh meat. It. Nobody on hold or anything. Nobody needing, like, urgent help. Thank you for calling our telephone meeting. Oh, uh, hold on. Wait, Use I the new uh, sound clips on. Don't forget to phone Derek as well. Let me get I need to try one. and get him. Which I'll one's get Derek? One real quick. Thank you I for calling our telephone meeting. If you are the moderator, please... This call has been blocked. Why? Do. Right at the bottom of show chat there, Derek. Remember the, the weird looking actor? Thank you for calling oh, our telephone meeting. Oh, that guy, yeah, you yeah, yeah. Enter the <laughs> if you are the moderator, please. There are currently 15 other participants in the conference. You have been kicked from this conference. Wow. Didn't even unmute. Oh, clear quick. They're <clears throat> waiting on you. Oh, my God. Yeah, probably not answer, but it's worth a try. And then oh, I just I just realised this this who this guy was tweeting to. Ooh. he was okay. tweeting uh, Philadelphia Phillies. Yeah, baseball, right? Yeah, because he's looking for a, a practicing a bat practicing hat. Do you know what? Honestly, he looks kind of because. Kinda, he looks so it's crazy, he almost looks disabled, and he's just asking his team for a hat. I kind of feel bad, like, what if we call him and he's no, just No, he's like... not disabled. That's not a real picture. Go look at him. He's a fucking actor. Oh, he's an actor. I don't know, yeah, he just looks complain... fucking He just looks fucking crazy. He's complaining that because the fanatics took his money and they blamed him. <coughs> Let me see if we can get a phone number for the Phillies. I think I think uh, Scobie should call, call, him. call him. You can call him as UPS because he's blaming UPS for losing it. No, but I was gonna call as okay. Yeah, we'll do we'll do that. I was gonna call as the you, Phillies, you but call the Phillies, but I just... should we say Tyrone got a new hat? Yeah, so yeah, you saw on social media you, uh, that UPS was blamed for not scanning the, uh, an item that was sold out. Yep. I call bullshit. He said, "All I want is my hat." He just wants some head. Or however you said it. <clears throat> it's probably not going to pick up anyway. I guess they won't. I have to remain positive. So I'll leave him a message saying we found his hat, but since he didn't pick up, we're going to put it in the incinerator. That'll teach him. This hat was found passed out after a night party. Hey, this is Derek's phone. One more Sorry. try. Yeah, that's him. Damn, we nearly got 100 likes. We got to 92 likes, Ronnie. What do you think about that? They didn't get us to 100. Not though. enough. Not enough, at least really. 100, motherfuckers. It should Come be on, at least 100. People. Eight more people could smash the like button, please. That'd be oh, yeah. uh, perfect. Come on. Oh, I got a tweet about you. I got Ready? you a new one. A new oh, I got one complaint. for you to read online. Ready? Mm. Hey, this is Derek's phone. Oh, no, what's this? Tomasina. Oh, here we go. Gonna she's gonna she's gonna sue them now. Who is this? Oh, copyright, copyright. We had to hang up. We can't. Gonna, not supposed to do copyright. Some blood in that too. Honestly, YouTuber started fucking me for playing. Um, the fucking cover version, basically this. Which is the old, um, whatever it's called. Little Spanish Fleet, whatever it's called. They Isn't got, that a game show? They're starting to copyright me for that. And they're also copyrighting me for Kevin singing Wonderful World at the end of the show. Can you believe that? Get the fuck out of here. Nope, they, they, they copyright strike cover versions now and they pick up Kevin singing Wonderful World. No joke. Even though the How back in, the even though the backing track is a cover version with a tempo change slightly, which is crazy.
Oh my god. That's what's happening. Damn AI robots. Anyway, that racist lady says she's gonna sue. Hey, we got 101 likes, hey, got 101. Ronnie. 101 likes. Perfect. Thank you, guys. Perfect, you posts. guys. Good work. She did, th she did three posts within a minute. Look at it. Oh, fuck the bitch. Oh, yeah, she's tweeting like crazy about me. Now we're just gonna leave her in her fucking mad menopausal Call fury. Call Genevieve. Fuck the bitch. Call Genevieve. Let's see if you can get her. Genevieve. Genevieve. What the fuck is visible? Genevieve. That is a nice name, to be fair. Is that French or something? Sounds like French to me. <coughs> it's a nice name, you know? Uh, now, what the hell is the company? Well, yeah, but you know. Ah. Uh, idea. Who is this? Hey, Ron, what's up? Hey, who this? Is your guy, Mungo. Mungo, what's happening? Nothing, man. It's, it's bullshit that they keep copywriting strikes and you. True story. Don't go singing any music. You can't do that nowadays. 2024. Yeah, indeed, man. No, well, I, hey, no listen, I have to do anything. I just, I just heard your uh, your prank call on YouTube earlier today. Which one? You kept faxing in. Oh, the fax one. <laughs> yeah. We haven't done that for years. We should do that again. The fax, the fax calls. No one has no a fax, fax machine. I think exist these days. Uh, hotels, I think you absolutely yeah. should, man. Like, there's nobody, nobody else has done that, and that was weird and and quirky, and it was just freaking funny, man. All like, right, I can make that happen. I can make that happen. Uh, yeah, we can watch this space. Maybe we'll do it next week or something. Remember the little okay. cartoon. Yeah, we used to fax that little cartoon, man. Uh, it was like a little cartoon of me, but we used to stretch it out so it went over like 26 pages. It was I just had a really long body, so I would just start coming out the fax machine on like a big, long fucking... <laughs> yeah, it would be amazing. I know, man. That, that's <laughs> funny as hell. I'm sure there's some businesses out there that are still using fax machines. Like, like that. That's that's a really, really cool original prank. But hey, anyway, I, I, I don't want to... Keep you on the phone. All um, right. Well, thanks for calling. Great, great show tonight, and uh, keep it up. Oh, thank and I'll you. I'll be listening. All right. Thanks very much. We love you, buddy. Take care. Love you too. Bye. Bye. Yeah. We gotta do. We gotta do the fox with the fucking penis. I remember once. I can't remember who did it. I want to say Ray, but it might have been someone else who was around at the time. But what the? We used to have a little game where someone would fax something to a hotel. And then you had to call and ask if your fax had arrived, but you weren't allowed to know what was in the fax, right? <laughs> I remember that. It was like a little game, yeah. And one time somebody did it to me, and it was this girl that answered, and they'd faxed over just a picture of Hitler, but with tits. <laughs> so it was like Hitler. Oh, no, that wasn't... Was it, it was someone, but he had a pair of women's tits, right? And it was oh, like, a, like a drawing or whatever. And they sent it over to this hotel. And I was like, hi, is my fax there? And she was like, uh, what was on the fax? And I was like... Uh, well, I don't know. I had someone sent it to me from the office, and she was like, because we've got a picture. Could you describe it to me? And I'm like, well, no. Again, I haven't seen it. And she was like, it appears to be Adolf Hitler with breasts. And I was like, what? <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> I was like, that's not my fax. No, Didn't actually. Didn't we fax things to the hotel to, to send I to actually, Mike Lindell's room? Uh, yes, we did fax Mike Lindell multiple times when he was doing that conference and we knew which yeah, hotel he was at. Yeah, we faxed all the guests, like yeah. all the speakers. We, yeah, yeah. we faxed everybody weird shit. Yeah. And didn't we get people to come, other people, yeah, you have to, to call come the... down to the desk and pick up the fax and deliver no, we it to had, the other person's room? We had a bunch of people's assistants picking up the faxes yeah, for us yeah. to make sure they got them. Like We had them running yeah. around the hotel because we like it's an urgent message. Yep. Yeah, good old Mike. He's going to come on the show at some point. He really wants to come. Jim wants to know when I'm coming back to Canada. Um, um, in May, basically, in May, for a few reasons. Got a bunch of shit going on. We're going to do the Macronathon from Canada this year. So, that's yeah, that's going to be real interesting. That's going to be real interesting. When I get tired, I'm going to have a swimming pool to jump into to like wake me up, which I think is going to really work. It's just going to be right out there, and I'm just going to leap in the swimming pool if I get really tired. I'm going to send fucking Hazel a whip. Every time you get tired, she can whip your ass. Whip. Hazel's going oh, yeah. to be on camera during the Macronathon. Did you hear that rumor? Yeah. Did you hear that rumor? No, no, I'm not. Yes, you are. You mean the dog, yeah. right? No, yeah. no. Real Hazel, you said you would. Well, yeah, maybe. With, the, with, the, with your new prop. Okay. Yeah. 
cover, put a mask on and fucking be a topless on the camera. <laughs> <laughs> Well, you got it. Okay. We are, okay. We actually we have a mask for Hazel for the Macronathon. You see. We do have a mask that I could wear, but we'll see. Um. So the company this woman's complaining about is called Visible, and I can't find a phone number for them. Me. Let me get your phone number. Called Visible. Fuck it. Fuck. There's no phone number for them. Yes, there is. Mm. Always a fucking phone number. Okay. Visible. Visible by Verizon. Tuk, 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 tuk. Where's the fucking contact as shit? Someone said, don't tell the border protection people you're working in Canada. I'm not working in Canada. I guess that's just Verizon. There is no phone number, you're right. No, I told you. See, Mr. Smartass. And this show is being broadcast from the UK right now, so it's uh, using the power of home networking. So there you go. What do you say about that? I'll just make up a phone number to call her from now. Let's see. Yeah, the motherfuckers got only chat, Twitter, or Facebook, that's it. Well, I'm just going to use my own phone number here. and then. Well, the company is called Visible by Verizon. Oh, by Verizon? Yeah, yeah. So basically oh, it's well Verizon that make, oh, okay. Well, that makes sense. Okay. Well, I'll just say Visible anyway. Who fucking cares? No wonder they haven't got a phone number. They don't want to be talking to people. These are just bulk numbers, so this may be a couple of few Genevieve's. You just gotta find the right one. Coco oh, said Hazel's hot. Uh oh. oh shit. Hazel, Coco's hitting on you. Hey, this is Derek's phone. So okay, that's, I hope that's so. Wait, why did it call Derek again? What the fuck are you doing, man? I t it just didn't copy and paste. Sometimes it just doesn't do it. For the last for the last ten numbers, you've just been calling Derek. Maybe no, I haven't. I'm calling Derek all night. Your call has been forwarded to voicemail. Oh no. Genevieve is too smart for this. Come on, Genevieve. She says she was paying protection on a phone that she doesn't have for 13 months and didn't notice, so we know she's not smart. Your call has been forwarded to... I fucking can't. King City mass shooting. What does that mean? What? What's King City? King City, Ontario? What? Shit. Four dead and three injured. Oh wait, no, that's in California. Oh fuck. Hello. Hi, is that uh, Genevieve? Yeah, this is Genevieve. Hi, I'm calling from Visible. Um, it's just regarding a tweet that you had sent out uh, with a complaint. Yeah. What happened? Yes. I'm yeah. I'm like, okay, well, the, I'm sure you read the tweet, right? Or did you not? Uh, crazy, yeah, crazy. no, I, you had some trouble reaching customer service. I just wanted to find out what happened. Well, so, okay, back, I'm like, I, how do I even timeline? Okay, I just realized, like, I, within this last, it was on Saturday, that I have been paying still for device protection on a, my phone that I had bought through you guys back in whatever, the year before. And my phone was stolen, and I had to work with y'all to even get back access so I could get into my Visible account um, because I couldn't access my phone because it was stolen. And I didn't even know at the time that I had protection on the phone that I had bought for you guys, nor was I advised about it that I had even had it while I was working with y'all's customer service. And now I, 
I'm like, I, I can't, or I did file a claim, but obviously it's, I guess there's a 90 day situation. So in the meantime, I had to buy a brand new phone and I'm still, pay, I still am paying for the device protection on the old phone. Hmm. Hmm. Crazy. Okay. Hmm. Very troubling. Let me um, see what I... not rich. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, let me see what I can do about this for you. So before we proceed, it's just policy in cases like this to do a quick IQ test. Is that okay with you? A what do you want? Yeah. So uh, it's just 10 questions. It's very quick. We don't have to ask for any personal information. Uh, it's just to establish uh, whether we need any special help here or anything like that. So um, I'm going to read you uh, three statements, okay? Um, mm -hmm. the, the question is, if the first two statements are true, is the final statement true? Okay, so think about this. Okay. It's quite, so statement number one, all inhabitants of this island always tell the truth. Statement number two, Adam always fails to tell the truth. Number three, Adam is an inhabitant of this island. Okay, so if the first two statements are true, is the final statement true is the question. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. I I just okay. I'll I'll <laughs> put good. I'll put yes for you. Okay. 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 It's wrong. The answer is no. But, right. Uh, I thought it was too, but I heard in the background a yeah. Did you hear that? That was your voice. Okay. Well, let's move on with the next one. Okay. Okay. I was like, did you hear that? Though? So it, like, was before I even said it. It was like yeah. Weird. That was your voice though. That no. was never had that ever cool. ever happened before like, on this hell? prank call show I guess it's, yeah. okay, okay well let's you. let's go on with question two let's let's, move on. let's see <laughs> yeah, let's let's see how we do here so uh okay the next one's pretty easy here pretty easy think about this one study is to knowledge as work is to and the options are trouble service experience disorder or experiment so study is to knowledge as work is to yeah. Can you say the options one more time? I'm so sorry. So the you options. Heard a yeah, right then too. I'm not even joking. Huh? Ah. Okay. Sorry. Ah. Right there. Huh? Are you ah. Ah. So okay. Ah. Huh? Okay. So study. Yeah. That's not me. Ah. 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 Mama, are you okay? Ah. Yeah, that's not me. Ah. I don't know what that is. Okay. That's what I'm telling you about. Well, let, let's. But I was like, uh, I heard. Okay, so let's try let's try and get through this anyway. So study is to knowledge okay. as work is to trouble, service, experience, disorder, or experiment. Ah. Huh? Ah. Yeah. Oh. Weird. Some kind of echo. Right. Huh. Um, so which one do you think it is? Would you like to have a guess? Service. Service. Okay. I'm gonna put service for you. And that again is the incorrect answer. Um, obviously, oh, experience experience would be the answer there. Yeah. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Okay. Uh, the next one: country is to president as state is to governor, yeah. senator, mayor, city council, or prime minister. So, country is to president as state is to as to was the governor. Governor. I'll put governor for you. Correct. Yes, Governor is correct. Okay, we got one. Excellent. That's perfect. Um, so the words electric and technology have what meanings? Similar meanings, contradictory meanings, or unrelated meanings? Electric and technology. Electric. Mm -hmm. uh, I mean, I think... Was what, sorry, what's the, the answer? What are the answers? Options? So, governor? No, it's not governor. That was the last one. I didn't so, say that. That's what I'm saying. Like, why is that happening? That's not even me saying that. Ah. Okay. That's not me. Huh? It was the governor. Ah. Oh, what the hell? So, so the words electric and technology have what meaning? Similar, contradictory, or unrelated? It was the governor. Uh, <laughs> ah. Unrelated. Ronathan, can you keep a secret? I didn't really have my phone stolen. I wanted a new phone, so I done an insurance scam to get a new one without having to pay for it. Like everyone does it nowadays. I'm huh? smart, ain't I? Are you hearing this? Oh, 
I probably shouldn't have heard that, ma'am. Let's just disregard you saying that. What do you think I the did answer not say is? That. I mean, I'm gonna get off the phone. <laughs> 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 Whoa! Still <laughs> <So> funny. <laughs> <laughs> I have to tell you all, guys, that so far we're halfway through the IQ test, and she was she was on point to have an IQ that would make her legally retarded. Um, <laughs> like le I checked it out. Now, not surprising. It would be about ten points below the point of being uh, medically retarded. Um, I just wanted to Down kind there? of prove a point that, um, yeah. I, I do hope she's good looking. The she looks, IQ test is amazing. She does look very pretty. I'll give I, her that. I hope so. I really hope so for her sake. <laughs> Let me find her. Yeah, let's find a picture of her. and uh, She's pretty, so she'll be okay, you know? That's, and that's, I need to that's know what that. we need, need to know. We need to know, know she'll be okay. <laughs> or else there's good, then I feel bad otherwise. She, she is okay looking. Not that pretty, let's have a look. Okay. At, let's have a look at her. I thought she... Uh, I mean, she's not gruesome or anything, you know. She's, she's okay. When when you're drunk, it's okay. Hazel, what's your opinion here? That's what she looks like. Relatively pretty, I would say. Oh, no, she's really pretty. Yeah. I think she's really pretty. Thank God. Thank God. She has nice hair. She's got a pretty face, yeah. nice skin. Well, no, she's a good-looking girl. A lot I'm, of makeup. I'm relieved because otherwise I was going to I was going to call the social services and uh, get somebody over there. On the microphone, <laughs> we should all do an IQ test, Ron. You want to yeah. do all an IQ us. test? All of us. Fuck you. Do you know what? I'll tell you. I'll tell you something, right? I always hate the math questions. I can't base. I can do all the logic and like stuff like that, but I have basically like a form of dyslexia when it comes to numbers. Like I'm horrible at maths. I have to have a calculator for everything. So. That kind of skews my score whenever... It depends, because some IQ tests are like very visual. Like It'll just show you several patterns, and it'll ask you to guess the next pattern. Or it'll be logical, like the one I was just doing here, which I would have been fine with. But like any question that like asks you to do like a bunch of numbers, and you have to do it real quick, that's oh, where I... That's easy as shit, bro. That's Math's easy. No, yeah, I have easy, like... Bro. I have... I'll just mark B for everything. You see, it's weird because my, my dad was dyslexic, right? Like, badly dyslexic. He had to, like, really work hard to, like, be able to cope with that. And I was always great with, like, writing English. Like, absolutely fucking great with it. But, like, I was shit with numbers. And he can do numbers really good. He's, like, great at maths in his head, and I'm not. And I'm wondering if it's some kind of reverse dyslexic crazy shit. That's my theory anyway, because I'm horrible at the maths. Probably so. And you want to make everyone do an IQ test? Yes. Scoby. You want to show oh, off? Bring it on. Oh, bring show it on. Yes. Give me one right now. Fuck it. I don't care. Who's that bitch right there in the chat? Who's that bitch? No chick That's the one we to. just talked to on the That's phone. It. Whoa. I'll give you a quick IQ test if you want to do it. I found the perfect one for doing over the phone. Let's do it. All right. A pack of gum costs 18 cents. How much will five packs cost? Ah. Well, 18 times five. Yeah. I hear people in the background. All right, so this is what I'm going to do. I'm not going to do 18. I'm going to do 20. I'm going to round it up to Oh, my 20. God. Come on, man. Fucking. Dude, oh. shut up, Ronnie. Shut up. Do That's, how do <laughs> That's how they do it in some countries. That's how they teach it. Holy shit. Can I do the question or no? All, All right, right so 20 them. times 5 is 100, and then you take off. You take off 5. Uh, Dude. Yeah, right, so, gonna... okay. Yeah, what yeah. Fuck? What's your answer? Nah, you guys fucked me all up. Ronnie, what the fuck? Oh, okay, I'm sorry. Ignore him. Let's do the, Let's get through it. There's 10 questions. Let's race through it, okay? Pack of gum costs 18 cents. How much do five packs cost? Okay, so yeah, I'm going to do the same shit I was going to do. I'm going to take it up to 20, right? You say 18 times five, right? Right. Yes. So 20 times five is 100, right? It's not, it's not 20, it's 18. So minus, 18 minus 2, two times two, 5, two, which two, is 10, two, which so is 90. Fucking 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. So 90 Nine. cents. 90 cents is the yeah. answer then. I, I get the logic of no. doing that. That is an actual easier way of doing it if you need an easier way. Correct. If, if you can learn to do those things, you can do any math. Yeah, that's how I do mine. Interesting. I'm just okay, why off. don't you, why don't you do it All right, come on, let's get easier, through it. easier way? No, come on. Okay. What do you mean easier way, bro? What are you talking about? That's the about? easiest way I got. Even I could yeah, do it. Even I did that. That is the easiest way. You round up or you round down. That's the easiest yeah. way. 
Ronnie's probably talking about ten times five and ten times eight. I mean, or five times I think eight. Ronnie's probably talking about using a calculator. Actually, Jim just made a very good point. In Ontario, if you That's fail the, um, if you want to get a visa here, they do a math test. Very good point. I've I have heard about that before. Shit. Better start studying. I better fucking like. I would like to know how advanced it gets, and then I know what to go study. Ah, Jesus. Oh, thank you. Somebody's calling. Hello. Oh, shit, I'm live? Yeah. Oh, Ron, I love you, Big Dad. Oh, thank you, son. I love everyone on the fucking show, dude. I wish I could have come to Florida in November when you came, but I couldn't. We'll I be hope back. you come back this year. We'll be back there. We'll be back there. Don't you worry. Who's this? What's going on? Awesome. My name is Gabriel. I've been a watcher of the show since 2019 to 2020. Okay. I'm an OG okay. subscriber. Wait, you watched the you show guys. from 2019 to 2020 and then you stopped? Is that what you're saying? <laughs> no, no, no. I stopped. <laughs> I was since 2019. Okay, all right. That's all right. Then. Wait, who's your favorite black guy? <laughs> oh, my God. Who's my favorite black guy? That's an interesting question. <laughs> who's the best black guy on the whole show? On the whole show? Um, you guys accept black guys on the show? <gasps> oh, it's Kobe. Oh. It's a, it's, Tyrone, of course. It's a trick question. We allow we, we allow one at a time. It's the right answer. <laughs> 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 Only one though. That's the that's the quota, and then we're in equal opportunities prank call podcast. That's how it works. Low key, sure of low key though, the other day I was thinking about making a fake complaint tweet just so you guys can call me and find my number. But since you guys posted the number today, I'm glad I was able to call and talk to you guys. Yeah, now we got your number, motherfucker. <laughs> well, <laughs> oh, people yeah, have, yeah, try people, doctoring me, bitch. I'm going to come to your house. People have done that before. Like a few years ago, I, I called a complainer, and, and when they answered, they were just like, fuck you, Macron. <laughs> and I was like, wow, okay. What, <laughs> like, you want your what you want on your pizza, motherfucker? I was disappointed that they went to all that effort, and then the punchline was like, fuck you, Macron. <laughs> I was like, come no, on, man. Really we yeah. appreciate a good call. Typical yeah. fucking twelve-year-old behind the fucking iPad. You mean you should you should do that anyway? You should try and get us to act, like call you as a prank. I'm gonna totally forget. I got, I got a question for you though. All right, do it, do it. All right, you should see if we see if we catch it. You'll never know until the end of the call. The best time to make the complaint would be Sunday night, Monday morning. All right, gotcha. I got I Thanks, got a question Rob. for you before you hang up though. Hold on, I got a question. What? What you what you want in your fucking pizza, motherfucker? Oh no! I got your number. Oh, now. on my pizza. Where are you gonna send it to? I got your address, motherfucker. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Pull up, pull up, and if you pull up, I'm gonna pull blow up. up the entire place. Whoa! Oh, Good, shit. you're gonna be in it, motherfucker. I won't. Whoa! 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 Let's all calm down a little bit here. He just likes you. Don't. I like don't. this dude. Don't take yeah, it violent. Him. Come uh, on. Join Discord, Yo, buddy. We could be best friends. Yeah, can, I, I would can... love to hop on a call with you guys. I'm not even a supporter or anything. Get Discord, but like... Oh, why not? Go, jump in Discord. It's free. Jump, jump in yeah, Discord. Yeah, I'm on Discord. Come in Discord. I think I'm on the Discord. I think I, I think I talked to Hazel before. Oh, but... okay. Well, yeah. Right, hang, yeah. hang around the Discord. We're always in there doing shit. All right. All right. Bet. Okay. Appreciate you guys. All right. Thank you. Right. Bye. Okay. All right, let's do Scobie's IQ test real quick, and then I'm getting out of here. Scobie, the words electric and technology, do they have similar, contradictory, or unrelated meanings? Hey, sorry, I'm taking a piss. Start over. I bet. <laughs> okay, I'm going to give you two words. Electric and technology, do they have similar meanings, contradictory meanings, or unrelated meanings? This is a tough one. I know what I'd pick. I'm so gonna... it was the electric and technology? Yeah. It was the last uh, option you gave. Unrelated. Yeah. yeah, that would be my choice. Correct. Yep. Okay. Correct. We know that. Okay. Here we go, Scoby. A water park has 70 lifeguards in the park from Monday to Friday and 110 lifeguards in the park on Saturday and Sunday. What's the average number of lifeguards in the park? Did you say 70 and then 110? Yep. So, the so I would add both of those, and I'd be 180, and you divide that by seven. Um, For seven shit. days, yeah. I'm drunk as fuck. Uh, 180 divided by seven is what? So 180, 170 divided by seven is... Okay, 10. So I'm going to say drunk as fuck 11. 
Oh, no, uh, that's wrong. No. I'll say probably around 80s. It's very wrong. Is it? Well, we should be. Yeah. You got 70 well, during yeah. the week, and then well, you I'm got wrong, so tell 110. Me. You got well, there, yeah. no, so what is the answer? I'll, I'll give you a multiple choice, okay? 26. 78, no, 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 no. 80. Later, I get the answer. 26. Well, give the answers. Give the answers. What are the choices? 26. 26. See, I well, I didn't get, I no. didn't get choices. How are you? Guys. Even I, I know I this. I didn't get choices. I no, said, you're, looking for the, you're looking for the mean average of 70 and 110. So it's, oh. it's going to be like 80. Right? What? 80. Yeah. Well, isn't that the question? Yeah, the average. So, so at the weekend it has 110. During the week it has 70. What's the average throughout the whole week? Well, it's going to be the average of 110 choices. and 70, yeah, yeah. which is what around. There are no choices. It's around 80. Ron just said, "I'm going to get multiple choice." Fucking, that's what he just said. Yeah, it is multiple choice. The the options are 78, 80, 81, 82.5, yeah, or 84. Uh, I say 81. Uh, that's what's going. Is it 81? I think that's what oh. it is. Yeah, easy. E l let me get some fucking multiple choice answers. You Someone know said 90. 90 is not even an option. 80 oh. or 81, Scobie? 81. It's got to be 81. I mean, you're answering for Scobie here. Scobie, what's your okay, choice? Scobie, what's sorry. your choice? What's your choice? Apologies. I didn't even hear you. What? What's your choice, Scobie? Say 81. 81. Okay. Oh. Correct. See? To work I it out, like to work it out, you add seventy <laughs> plus seventy plus seventy plus seventy plus seventy plus one ten plus one ten, mm -hmm. and and that's five hundred divided by seven. Divided by seven is yeah, is eighty one point four. However, the answer is eighty one point four. However, you can't have half a person, so you would have to round it down because you it's less than five. You round it down to, to eighty one. Number yes. That's the correct logical answer. Yeah. Okay, study is to knowledge as work is to trouble, service, experience, disorder, or experiment. So study is to knowledge as work is to... We had this one already. She answered it already. You should know this. That Did lady she? answered it. Yeah, trouble, service, experience, disorder, or experiment. This one's easy. Come on, Scobie. Okay, so you said study is to knowledge is two, and then you said the next two is like six different answers. Yeah, so study is to knowledge. So how is study related to knowledge? So work, uh, as work is to A, trouble, B, service, C, experience, D, disorder, or E, experiment. Well, it's, what was the second one you said? Service. Okay, and continue on. So it's that or continue on. What are the other options? Experience, disorder, or experiment. So it could be experience, but I'm going to stick with my answer. Okay, what's your answer? The second blah, 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 one, blah. I don't remember. Service. <laughs> Work uh, is service. No, experience. It's got to be experience, yes. Yeah, so if you study to gain knowledge, you work to gain experience. Mm -hmm. That's what it's saying. Yes. Yeah. Oh fuck! The next one's visual. <laughs> Replace. Oh, oh fuck! fuck. The, next one, the next one's one of those stupid ones with patterns. I'm just gonna guess and then. <laughs> you more math. Incorrect. I know, right? <laughs> oh, the, the next one's the one we've already got. Fuck this stupid quiz. Fuck it. The next one's the one we already asked that lady. It's fucked. Ma I'm... Make up some shit. Give me some math shit. <laughs> Make up some shit. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, come on, I'm nearly there. I'm so close. No, <laughs> Give no, me some more numbers. No, he was actually, you know what we can do, Scobby? Late at night, we can fucking get in uh, voice and fucking play that shit. Yeah, do it. Okay. I'm, all, I'm all up for that. We, we can fucking do that shit. We'll do some you little know, challenges and shit. We were going to learn Japanese once in the in the Discord. Does anyone remember we that? We learned Japanese in the Discord. No, we were going oh. to. We had a whole plan, right? We were going to make a special room for it in Discord, and then we were all going to go in there. Try. Who's going to teach it, Kevin? No, we were just yeah. gonna find some online videos or whatever, and we were all gonna yeah. learn Japanese, like all oh, of us, Japanese. right? Just so we could prank Japanese people. Just because I figured they'd never see it coming out of everyone in the world, right? No fucking way does some dude in Japan expect me to be calling <laughs> from here and talking Japanese. Like they'll never see it coming. The pranks could be amazing. We could get them doing all kinds of shit. Japanese pranks. Think about that. I think we should still do it as a little, you know, like a side project. Uh, I don't think I want to fucking learn Japanese. Oh no. 
You see, I can do a fucking quiz or some shit like Google this. Google Translate. It seems like the craziest reason ever to learn Japanese, but it have a lot of benefits, you know? I mean, like, you, you, you spoke fluent Japanese and English. You could get a really good job, you know? Really good well, job. Well, Mandar Mandarin is the right choice, right? You think Mandarin? Yeah, it's the number one spoken language in the world. Uh huh. But I think Jap Japan's a funnier place to prank call for some reason. I don't know why. I just think I just think they'll never see it coming. You know? I think it'll be amazing. Start talking shit to people in Japanese. It's nothing against the Japanese. I love the Japanese people. I just think it's so funny. Like, it's such a an opposite language. It'd be so hard to learn and get fluent with it that it like the payoff would be amazing. Can you imagine me, like, yelling at some Japanese guy to shut up? In Japanese, it'd be amazing. Didn't someone make a fucking uh, dub video with Japanese or whatever <laughs> not long ago? Oh yeah, um, who did it? I think Belfast did it. No, was we did, did yeah, we did. Yeah, that we, was me. Yeah, did. a Hindi <laughs> version of a show, and we've got a yeah Japanese version of your show. Yes. Why don't? Oh stuff. man, that was amazing. <laughs> Can you do a lot more of those? Because like, I might start a whole 100%. new YouTube channel, Macron Show Japan, and just put it out there and see if they start listening. There's no harm on it. Yep, of course I can. I, I actually, do you know what we need? Actually, this is this is straight up. We need someone who speaks Japanese to... So we used an AI to translate like some prank calls and make them into YouTube videos. Just cause, and, and yeah, we got, we got a fucking... We got a Japanese translator call. But we need someone that speaks Japanese to listen to it for me and verify that the AI did it correctly. Because we have no earthly way of knowing what... And the Indian like, do the Indian one too. Yeah, and we did one in Hindi as well. So um, basically, we need someone who speaks Hindi to listen to the Hindi one, and we need somebody who speaks Japanese to, to listen make to sure the Japanese the shit makes one. Sense. And I need to know it makes sense in Japanese because I know, yes. like, you can't literally translate, and literally is the correct word in this case, um, Japanese to English. So they don't like. They don't even have the same letters as us. They don't have the same alphabet. So how could you like? And right, right. there are certain things they don't have a word for. Um, and my understanding of how it works as well is like a different sound can mean the same thing depending on how you say it. Do you know what mm -hmm. I mean? Like the pitch of it, of how you say it. So I have no idea how all that fucking works. Like no idea. So like that's, that's all the shit we need to know is like how good did the AI get it? Is it just fucking nonsense or would Japanese people actually listen to it and find it funny? And it's whether the jokes work as well. You know, there's some... I used some quite specific insults on the show. Hopefully this is a Japanese person calling. Thank you. Welcome to the show. Do you speak Japanese? Um, no, I definitely do not speak Japanese, but I do love Japanese food. Okay, that might work. That might work. Hi, what's your name? Um, I actually wanted to speak with Diaz. Oh, geez. Fine. All right, Diaz, call for you. Hello. Hi, Diaz. How are you? Good. Ooh, your voice Who is you? so sexy. Really? <laughs> and mine's not. Really? Who are you? Unbelievable. Unfucking believable. <laughs> really? Well, They're making up the new show. South... Fuck you, Diaz. I'm from South Texas. Oh, um, you're breaking up. I we have... can't hear you. Yeah, I speak Spanish, so I mean, even that oh. was like super Sorry. Chica, Chica Luca. Hey, what's up? <laughs> Did, oh, yeah. I'm like super crazy. So, yes, yeah, that was super hot. Sorry. Sorry. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. <laughs> All right. Where, where well, you, where are you calling from? Hey, slide into my DMs there, girl. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Wow. <laughs> sorry, Macron. Sorry, Macron. It's you just, should, I, yeah, you should like, be sorry. Yeah, it's just in there. It's like, just seriously, there. his <laughs> voice over mine. Like, really? Like this well, is a. I've always, I've always liked yours, but just like the S is just like, ugh, it's unbelievable, just so hot. unbelievable. Wow, the S, you got a fan. All right, you should definitely get in the Discord. You're gonna have a lot of fans in here. Come in the Discord. Go to macronshow.com <laughs> forward slash Discord and come hang out with us. And you can hang out with the S every day then. Okay. Yeah. Oh, definitely, definitely. There you go. I, I love that. And use a man's name when you join. FYI. <laughs> 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 yeah, I would. I would do that. 
All right. Yeah, definitely. I wouldn't do that. You're gonna get kicked out immediately. Use your uh, name, and Chica, or whatever. If, if hot Latina, whatever well, you want, that way Dia's gonna yeah. know that's you. I mean, it swings and roundabouts because let me tell you, if you use a man's name, you're gonna have Dale and uh, Scoby and Ray hitting on you, and if you use a female name, you're gonna have me oh, no, and no, uh, no, Scoby. Hey. No. No, Scobie. Sorry. You, you better not. Yeah. Definitely not. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely not, guys. Okay. Bitch, you know you want a nigga. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really. Come to Discord. Join us I'm, in Discord. I'm really sorry about him. He's one of those people. Well, no, people that say rude threat. things. Yes. Yeah. Well, no. Okay. Zero to a hundred real fast, guys. Yeah. No. Calm it ha down. it happens. That's what, how it goes. That's how it goes. These are they're a very rowdy crowd. It's really hard to keep them under control these yeah, days. Come in here. We only have like a couple girls. We need more. Come yeah, on. Yeah, we in. do need more. Oh. It is a real sausage fest we in here. We, we do, do need do. some more girls. Do. Hazel, Hazel, we'd be a power couple, baby. We would be a power. Sounds couple. good to me. Ooh. Listen, the heart wants what the heart wants. <laughs> you join. Can we all? Can we all watch you? Somebody fuck with you. Can we all watch sure you being a power couple? You. Can we all watch <laughs> yeah. you being a power oh, yeah, couple? Baby. That'd be great. I love a lot it. of donations. Love yeah. Which one's the power couple? All right, excellent. But Just, do uh, do seriously join us in Discord, though. We do need more join, females in there to represent. Join you know? Discord. Don't join Discord. Discord. I'll, I'll take I'll take care of you. I'll handle it. DS will show you around. Anybody. We got he, we, anybody we, we, fucking around. He's a moderator in there. He's totally going to give you like all the VIP roles just to oh, keep yeah. you in there. He will. He'll hey, do I it. He'll speak, do it. I actually speak Espanol though. On some real shit. Does that mean anything? Hey, I'm down. I'm down with orgies. Let's do it. We should totally do oh, it. Oh, fuck. I'm, I'm being happy with that. Oh. All right. Get in this go right now. <laughs> Slide the DMs right now. <laughs> We're going after show, I'll, guys. I'll plug in my Discord, guys. But that's not all the plugging we're going to do. Wow. Oh. Wow. All right. Give her the VIP roles right now. That's the. <laughs> this is the other way I'm... you get to become a premium member, by the way. We shouldn't. We're not technically allowed to mention it. <laughs> but oh, <laughs> this premium. just happened naturally, Thank you know? You. I'm, I'm, I'm happy with premium. All right. There you I, go. I'm not. I, I love premium, guys. Let's. Nice. You sound you sound like a premium kind of person, except you have terrible taste in men. That's all I'm going to say. <laughs> how big are your tits? <laughs> Sweetie, how big are your tits? <laughs> <laughs> how many fingers? Look, I'm, I, I'm, 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 I'm not an unleaded type of girl, guys. I like premium, so I, I'm sorry. Like, let's okay. do it. I'm, I, that's, I, I'm Macron. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, I'll go now. For, don't I'll be no. Don't now. don't be sorry. sorry, but um, hit us all up when you get in Discord, okay? Don't you be sorry for being so premium? Yeah, we no, you. we love you. You're great. Come in Discord. Uh, come in Discord. No will fuck around. More of this, please. Okay, baby. I'll I'll plug I'll plug in my Discord oh. ASAP. Sounds hot. Is that her? Oh my god. Okay. All right. Oh, bye. No. Okay. Oh. Bye. Bye. See you soon. Bye. Talk to you soon. Mwah. <laughs> Mwah. Wow. Wow. What a call that was. Oh, what, what a call that was. DS. DS has got himself I, a... Uh... Well, I, was almost, I was almost done. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> uh, she's calling me back already. No, she's not really. Oh, damn. Hello. Hello. Hi. How you doing? Shut the fuck up, you suck. Phonelizard.com, fucking faggy, fucking piece of shit. Shut the fuck up, you fucking Oh, whore. amazing. We needed more girls. More girls. Yes. Thanks for calling. We, we we looking for girls, not bitches. Oh, wow. really right now. Did you hear his little gay ass voice? I about, love it. I was way I was like fucking yeah, late fuck? as fuck as well. Actually, you right know at the I end think, of the I show. Think we're going to open the line fucking next show too. I like the fucking thing. Mm -hmm. I like problem. it. Yeah, I like yeah, it yeah, too. yeah. I want more trolls calling That's in though. Great idea. I want more calls. Call I want more trolls calling in. I want to uh, look at. What? I don't know one in. Uh... What do you call it, Hindi? I've just translated a short call in Hindi. Have you? Can we? Do we get to hear yeah. it? Hello? Yeah. yeah. So oh. I, I wanted to give you a little update. Uh uh. Go on. What I happened? Got, I got out of the bathroom finally. I, I returned the the half a tire and the spatula key. Um, just to get my license back. And he gave it to me. And now I guess I'm, apparently I'm a different guy. I'm, I, I, I guess my name's Larry, and I live in Montana. Um, yeah. All right. Thanks. And I'm naked. 
Thanks for calling you in. You raised sheep. Thanks for calling in, Larry. <laughs> yeah, you bet. Bye, Larry. You bet. Yeah, Larry. All right. All right. <laughs> Bye. Love you. Bye. I love you too, Larry. <laughs> Holy shit. I'm not going to get off the air here. Oh, my gosh. Hello. Who, who are you calling gay, you fucking piece of shit? <laughs> no, it's all right. Talk some more. Please talk some more. Come on. I'm pretty <laughs> fucking piece of shit. Let him quiet, quiet, quiet. Let him, let him talk. He call, they called in. They will got something to say. Go ahead, say it. Yeah, well, why do you steal Brad's show, you fucking retard? Okay, Ew. what else? Okay, yeah, all you do all you do is a skid. You're a fucking skid. You're not no hacker. You ain't shit, nigga. You heard me. Okay. Hacker. It's a fascinating call. Go, go mm. ahead. Wigger. I'm not a pedophile. You're Russian, I, I'm you're also, Russian piece of shit. I'm also not a pedophile. We have a lot of different things going on. You are a pedophile. You are a pedophile. Mm. Listen, the fucking <laughs> wet back calling me a Russian piece of shit. Man. Yeah, you little Ukrainian piece of shit. Go back to your fucking country, you little fucking nigger. <laughs> a a black I love guy. his fruity little voice and his little stutter. He's Bro, like, go back to, go back and, to and school. And I'm 14. I'm 14. You're a pedophile. Yeah, done. you're a fucking pedophile. You uh, we're dude. glad to perch individuals like no you. No wonder you're 14. That's what you're doing listening to Brad. Did he groom you? Yeah, it looks like. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, he didn't. <laughs> you're like his fucking target audience, aren't you, there, buddy? <laughs> he has to take a minute. That. Every time he talks, he has to take a minute to get his courage out before he I speaks. Who's that whore talking? Who's that whore talking? I love his little stutter. I love his little. He's like. Boop, 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 boop. Say it's some so more fucking stuff. cute. Did, give us some more. Didn't, didn't she break up with you? Did it? Did it? Did it? Come on, well, give us some more. You've been listening <laughs> to the show. Answer the question. Did he get breaking up with? Not yet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can you not, fucking loser. You You're can't, fucking loser. You can't hear that voice on the phone, wait. though. Are you uh, that wait, fucking wait, stupid? Wait, 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 wait. wait. <laughs> how do you talk about girls when you never touch pussy before, boy? <laughs> He's fucking virgin. Who's that retard talking? <laughs> Who's that retard talking? <laughs> retard. Yeah. You're so... You're so fascinating. Tell us who's more. That? Who's that? Yeah. Who's, who's that? this bitch talking? Shut the yeah, fuck up. No one's talking to you. Who's that bitch? Who's that bitch? Who's that bitch? Who's that bitch? You a pussy, nigga. You a pussy. Real talk. Oh, I see you real life. I'll eat your ass out, nigga. Come on. Yeah. Jesus. Oh, man. Come. What a come bitch. to Discord, we can discuss over there. You what know, a little private. bitch. I'll come right now, you fucking pussy. You ain't gonna do shit about a little Russian little nigger. <laughs> and here is your and here is your average phone losers fan everybody keep talking where, 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 do, you live, man? where do you live you know i'll come what? over right now you live in canada i'm in edmonton piece of shit come over you know oh what? really we invite you to do the yeah, I'm in edmonton. Test, okay let's face it. okay buddy edmonton, okay Alberta. pull up pull up oh, nigga. pull up give me your address i'll fucking pull up no you send not. me about pull up right now that motherfucker lives pussy. down south. Probably pussy. fucking Scob is the closest yeah. one by him. I pussy. know, but the I'll pull up. Is. Listen to this pussy ass. Wait, wh where'd fucking... you say I live, little Russian guy? Where'd you say? I didn't say shit. I'm I sorry that, 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 I'm sorry that you, you like you pedophiles and you're a virgin, buddy. Why are you so angry about it? Pull up to Edmonton, piece of shit. Why don't you try getting laid or something? Like, what's actually wrong? Why don't you wrong? get to try getting laid? You literally got broken up with. I mean, I can not? tell that your balls haven't dropped from your gay what little voice. What happened to your girl? What happened to your girl right now? What, what the, one that's, the one that's on the phone, you stuttering little faggot. Listen to you. But I'm 14, though. <laughs> Wait, how am I the girl? Wait, what? You're a or fucking a virgin man. kid. You're a virgin. You're a little fucking. No, you're a I'll little you. fucking incel. fairy little boy. Incel. You're a little fucking phone oh, losers really, incel really, really. fairy you boy you're virgin. I didn't pull up on Discord right now, pussy shit. You're, you're a, a, you're a pedophile you. supporter. You're a pedophile supporter. Now go away, okay? Where did you learn your nah, grammar from? Call of Duty. Listen to Who's you. Who's that fucking retard talking about you too, nigga? Well, come in this I'll kill you, I'll kill you nigga. I'll kill you, nigga. I'll kill you, nigga. Wow. You gotta quit saying that word. Man. You gotta quit saying that word. You gotta stop playing first person shooter games. I love nah, this dude. We should, you, we should get you're this dude on every week as like Brad's biggest fan. Oh, yeah. And he can talk to us about I it. I like him. And fucking wreck their reputation even more. Keep going. Keep going, right, buddy. Fuck y'all niggas. No, I'm leaving right now. Fuck all y'all niggas. Pussy. Niggas suck, run away. Float away, you fairy. Go on. Fuck off. How am I fairy? Okay. How am I fairy? Go listen to that wow, fat you're... pedophile. Wow. Fat pedophile you supporter. Fat pedophile supporter. Wow. Someone else is calling. Who this? Oh, sure. Hi. Hey, Macron. Hey, how's it going? Macron. Yes? I'm here. Can you... I'm here. Turn your radio down, caller. Uh, 
Uh, my um, girl just called in, bro, and she forgot to plug in her Discord. She was the one that was talking to you right now. Oh, shit. That's your girl. Here, here. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. Fuck. Yeah, that's my girl. Here, here, here she is. She forgot to plug in her used Discord. used to be your girl. Yeah, you used to be a girl. <laughs> <laughs> I was waiting for that. <laughs> what? 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 Hello? That's up to you, bud. Hey, have you given him the bad Hi. news? Have you I, told him the bad no, news? No. Yeah. What happened? No, no. We're, he's he's my best friend. <laughs> oh, no. oh, she just friend zoned him on friend the air. Oh, <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. He's my friend, guys. Oh, jeez. Oh, this is awkward. <laughs> oh, oh, this is awkward. <laughs> Amazing. I leave, I leave every, anybody for Macron, guys. Sorry, Diaz. Wow. Wow, I'm back. sorry. Uh, about that. Hey, hey, that's all right. As long as I get a little taste, I'm good. <laughs> tell yeah, him, guys, if you if anybody saw how I looked, shit. Tell you him get, you want lots of taste of this. Tell him after we have the orgy, we'll send him a free uh, T-shirt matter, from the show. He'll we'll send him a free <laughs> T-shirt from the store. Okay. It would be fantastic, guys. There you go. We can send. Yeah. My girl yeah, was me, stolen by DS, the and all I got was this T-shirt. Yeah. <laughs> At least Diaz sent me a t-shirt. Yep. Send him a condolence t-shirt. We're going to send oh. you a dildo, dildo with the life-size dick. Diaz yeah. is life-size dick. That's what we're going to send you. <laughs> you, see what, you see what he's working. What, what the guy, fuck is... Wants, this, guy's, this guy wants a free t condolence t-shirt as well. No wow. problem. Did nah. you just say we'll nah, send a, a life-size replica of Diaz's dick? Yeah, yeah, that's what we're going to send. Oh my god. Yeah, we'll we'll send what it we'll send shit. we'll send it in a matchbox. Yeah. Oh! oh my god. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. Oh my god. <laughs> Today show fucking everything. went way out of whack. <laughs> I think is, we should yeah. end this. This is what happens, you know. All right. Oh my god. We have to go now cuz uh, we have to end the show. All but right, thanks guys. for calling. Bye. 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 Join Discord. I'm waiting. Oh fuck, man! <laughs> what? What do you want? What do you want? It's a fucking block number calling as well, <laughs> DS. You know. Yeah. You know? <laughs> answer it. Answer it. Let's see. Hi. Okay, nice. You run. You stole Brad's show. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you fucking loser! Get off my phone. <laughs> You, you jerk, fuck stop saying mouth. that. No. <laughs> God damn it, Gators. Hello. I just, I just want to apologize. <laughs> <laughs> I'm actually a phone, uh, buy me a coffee supporter. You fucking that's asshole. <laughs> That's it. Charge his card again. Hazel, charge his card. No. Hey. I'm, giving, <laughs> hey. I'm giving him a on, hold on. subscription. Hold on. Hold on. So it's so it's sixty five percent of Brad's listeners. Oh no, sorry, he doesn't have any listeners left. Oh no fuck. Oh no. Yeah. No one, none of them so called him. Disappointing. Disappointing. Let's just leave all that behind us. It's all jokes, okay? Don't 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 nobody take that shit seriously. Yeah. Just jokes joke. called jokes it's called jokes yeah. guys that's what we all do all the love it's all well, love it's all love really yeah he was funny though unlike the guy yeah, that yeah. called right before him whoever that fucking prick was with a weird fucking voice that woman whoever she was thank you for calling oh, oh somebody joined discord hold on press one Otherwise, please hold Wait, the hold on, in hold the on. conference. We're getting one more call. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna take one more call and then. Hi. Talk. Hello. Hello. Ron Blockman. Hello. Ron Blockman. Yeah. Hello. You've got to speak now. Okay, he hung. Well, people so usually the, the way the the way the phone works. If yeah. somebody gotta answers, you it's speak. It's got to be a back and forth. You know, you can't do that. You can't. There's got to be some some kind of 
noises and shit coming out. Silly. Silly. All right, I'm leaving. Uh, Ronnie, I might need your help with Wednesday's show. Oh, fuck me. Hello? I think someone can lick my labia lips and twiddle yep. my twat and clitoris. There you go. I'll do it. He hung up. Okay. All right, that's enough calls for now. <laughs> that's enough Shut of that down. shit. Shut it down. Shut down the machine. This whole experiment has failed. Shut um, it down. It was, I think it was next, such a good idea. Actually, we again. might do it again. Yeah, we might do it I again. I love it. Yeah. By spammers now. You know how many calls I'm going to get this week if I don't burn that number, by the way. Burn the we number. Can get a new, yeah, burn the yeah, number. Yeah, burn, burn the fucking number. I don't know. I'm, gonna, I'm just going to leave it and see who calls. Um, right, Ronnie, you, you might have to help with Wednesday's show, Ronnie. Be prepared, okay? Because, um, yeah. You'll be fine. I, oh, fucking oh, fuck. Course. No, because I get back to England on Wednesday morning, and I don't know what... Yeah. what I don't know what state I'll be in by Wednesday night. That's the You'll problem. You'll be fine. You say that, but I might just be asleep. Maybe. We'll figure some shit out. Oh, Hazel the dog wants to get in on the show. What is it? What are you saying? Can you hear He's this? telling us bye. Oh, no. Hazel the human. What is it, Hazel? What is it, Hazel? Um, can you come and take Hazel the dog out for a poop? She just gave me the... Yeah, I have you? Oh, okay. She's, she's giving me the specific I want a poop sign. Oh, it is called okay. deep poop. She tells me... It. She has a signal for when she needs to poop. And only I know it. But I'm telling you, she needs to poop right now. Okay, I'm on my way. She's like staring at me like, yes, yes, I do. I've sent for someone to de-poop you. Don't worry, dog. You just wait there for a moment, okay? Can't quite see her on the camera, but she's down there. Go on the socials if you want to see a picture of her. Yeah, Ronnie, I might need help on Wednesday's show. Like, I might be asleep, so, um, you know. If all else fails, we'll just move it to Thursday, though, you know? Yeah, we'll figure something out. We'll figure it out. But Wednesday's show might be a whole bunch of fuckery, but then Friday's show will be really good. We're also bringing back movie night on Friday by very popular request. Yeah, yeah and you might motherfuckers want to play 20-year-old fucking movie. They want to watch Porky's on Friday. <laughs> That's why everyone voted for, but I think everyone was drunk when they decided. Porky's. They want to watch Porky's. Oh, exactly, oh, yeah. exactly. He don't ever watch it. I say we'll watch something new. Ain't I don't know. Good. There's nothing new here. Yeah. Yeah, I know, but I don't know. Okay. We'll, we'll see. Maybe if we don't find anything to watch, we'll watch Titanic again. Nope. Well, anyway, <laughs> just remember the Wednesday show may get fucked around a bit, but Friday's show will be back on course, and we'll be in in here. Yeah. We'll, we'll be in be Discord here. in we'll between be anyway. We'll be doing shit all the we'll time. We'll be here Wednesday. DS and we'll I will be Wednesday. watching Titanic. All right, everyone, say no. goodbye. Thanks Every for. Time. Every time. Every time. Everyone go on Discord, Hazel says. Microshow.com, yeah. bitches. Good night, everyone. Discord, get your ass in here. Say good night. Goodbye. Yell good night, everyone. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Yay. Log, do you want to play yeah. some Enshrouded after this? Yeah, sure. Yeah. I get some food and play play Enshrouded for a couple yeah. of hours. Yay. I'll be in What's Discord. What's wrong with you, Log? You're fucking baked. Yeah. He's always baked. Yeah. Thank God. <laughs> All right. That bye, guys. Me, See you next week. Da 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 Drive me into the Ashmi parking lot. My name is Tom Kinnam and I am a racist. Fuck off. I put the wrong address in the app. Fuck off. Like I only ordered a lift as I killed my friend. Fuck off. I'm here. Da 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 Ron Blackman is the sexiest oh man I've ever God. heard, and I masturbate to a show every week, and so should you. I'm a terrorist! Like, I only ordered a lift as I killed my friend. I am the reason there was a funeral. I had to get out of there quickly. That's why I ordered a lift. Yeah, calm down. You need a dick or something to calm you down? I can help you with that. Gigino Trattoria. I'm creepy. I'm creepy. Lick it. Lick it for me. I'm creepy. Oh, bit my mouth. Oh, oh. Uh, throw it up. I'm so on the bases. Fuck off. Fuck off. My name is Thomas Enum and I am a racist. Fuck off. Yes, they did. Yes, they did. This is Raylene. Give it to me. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. I'm the carrot. 
Mahmoud Lokman. Maas. Lick it. Mmm. Love maas. Mmm. You have a nice body. Lick it for me. Fucking pair of boobs, huh? You know, you're gonna be a bottom. Mmm. Okay, yeah. What in the world is the art? I, the redeemed of the Lord, decree and declare that as Jesus caused the figure to die, every goodness in your life dies now in the name of Jesus. Do you hear me, you son of a bitch, mentally warped person? Do you hear me? Sounds very Christian of you. Don't you ever get tired, go to sleep, good night.